you guys don't know who Curtis is, he's like a resident uh, loser. Loser. Can't even beat Granny in a uh, eating contest, but he can eat some fucking wings. Let's uh, let's go over his little wing wing dinger. Okay. How you feeling, Curtis? Tapping out? No, not tapping out. Not tapping out. Okay. Oh, okay. I didn't know you had dancing in here. All right. The unburned. <laughs> I haven't actually, uh, full disclosure, I haven't actually watched your editing of this, so we're going to skip around, but I just thought, like, because it's your birthday and I wanted to get around to it, we'll fucking do it anyway. So uh, here's here's our very own Curtis Virtus uh, 360. Uh, Kurt versus 360 says, I just ate your ass. Shows you've never watched his stream. That's his intro of a show. Or, yeah, does it or does it just show I go forward? You don't have to be antagonistic, Mikey. I get it. You've had a lot of fun in your Corvette, so you're being a prick. I get it. Stop being a Corvette owner, bro. Welcome to the stream. No flaws thus far. <laughs> I would be remiss. Shut up, prick. Prick jinx. Pranks. Yes. If I didn't say hello and welcome, friends and neighbors. Thank you so much for joining me. The pleasure is indeed all mine. Here's a line for that Seattle Great Wheel. No entrance unless accompanied by a staff member. Wings over Washington? Wow. Gosh, it is like... It is... It is warm. Not gonna lie, I've been in the sun for like the last couple of hours and it's warm. It is definitely warm. Ooh. Some of that fresh fruit would sound good. Maybe right after the wing contest. I wonder how late they'll be. If they'll still be around, I'll come back and see. So it's like their own like little pure Santa Monica, Fisherman's Warp type shit. Well, I'll be honest with you, friends and neighbors. I would uh, be lying if I said I wasn't a little nervous. I'm trying not to focus on the negative right now. I'm trying to focus on the mission at hand. And the mission at hand is being the... Uh, first contestant finish first place that is the plan that is the mission today oh right here in the shade feels nice Gosh. does it how much found footage was this Did, like two hours that you edited down to a half hour okay well whatever you guys can go to seattle you can see all the cool shit that's not what we're here for we're here for this look at all these people on the wall that's so cool I can pop in the Discord. Yeah, pop in if you want. Am I in there? Am I not in the Discord right now? What the fuck? Hold on. Fucking Bush League, Corey. Shout out to Crack Babies. My bad. Crack Babies always gets mad when I'm not in here. I love you, Josh. I'm sorry. I really let you. I really let you all down. There we go. Okay. Hi. Hello? Yo. I couldn't tell if that was you in here or the video. I was like, he's either stuttering a bunch or he's actually in the Discord. <laughs> so first off, happy birthday. Big 40. That's a big one, right? Yeah, I appreciate it. Yeah, I took the day off of work and uh, the plan is to sleep in. It was to sleep in, wake and bake, catch some of the Tour de France, catch Twitch Shock, and then my lady and I are heading to the lake here in a couple hours. So oh, nice. Have a nice fun day planned, yeah. Wait, the Tour de France? I thought that started next week. That started already? Uh, no, it's it's always the first three weeks of July. I always thought it was the last three weeks of July. Yeah, and it's the shit I never, it's I never, always I never it's always watch anything. Birthday, I never watch anything until the final cool stage. It's mountain stage. So. It's fun to watch. Yeah, I never watch anything until the final stage. Like, I love the, like, it's like stage three or four where they're, like, all tired and they have to do all the hilly shit. That's my favorite. Yeah, they were in the mountains today, and so it's, okay. it's it's fun. Yeah, I don't, I'm not as into it this year as I've been in years past, but I always enjoy the tour. Nice. So yeah, so okay, you edited this down to about 40 minutes. It looks like right, uh, like 36. Yeah, sure, I rounded up, whatever. Uh, but I, how long was it? Like two or three hours of found footage that you had to edit through. Uh, it, the live stream was just over two hours and it was, uh, but I was uh, simultaneously uh, recording to my SD card. So yeah, just over sure. two hours. And you're using that GoPro, right? I'm using the GoPro, and then there was maybe a total of like one minute that was filmed from my phone, and sure. I just spliced it in there because it just made more sense to are film you using, it from my are phone. Are you using but... the mic on the GoPro too? 
No, I'm I'm actually considering. Well, <laughs> no spoilers alert here, but I was planning on taking some of that prize money and uh, buying some GoPro shit with it. And what I want to get is a they have a media mod when basically you can add some mics on it. But I just use the the built in whatever the external microphone that's on the GoPro. It works okay. So then, so I mean, then, it's, so it's then sufficient, yes. but it's so not. Then yes, ideal. it is the GoPro for the audio. Yeah. <laughs> I said, is, are you using the GoPro for audio? And you're like, no, I was going to get all these accessories and then I'm just using the one on the GoPro. Oh, no. I, well, I want to get an extra one. Yeah. yeah, 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 yeah. <laughs> no, it sounds pretty cool that the picture resolution is really good. Yeah. And actually, yeah, this was uh, filmed in 10, 1080p. So it, this, it streamed in 720, but it, it recorded on the SD card to 1080. So okay. it's, it's high def. Yeah. Nice. Uh, yeah, if it's built in, it's an internal mic, Curtis, says Mikey. Mikey Two Milks is, uh, he's in a bad mood. He's, uh, he woke up and <laughs> chose chaos today. He's a real big prick today. <laughs> yeah, and when it comes to audio, Mikey gets a little snobby, so it's, it's all good. <laughs> uh, you could have, you could have left out that audio comment and just said Mikey gets a little snobby. <laughs> yeah, Jesus Christ, he turns 40 and starts talking in Boomer. Oh, Mr. yeah. Well, Mr. Right. Approachable, get off my fucking yard. <laughs> How about that for t talking like a boomer? <laughs> get off my yard. I think it's get off my lawn, but whatever. Get off my lawn. There we are. I See, I'm already losing my memory, too. I'm fucked. Yeah, well, you're probably ripped, too. You're probably higher than oh, giraffe there. pussy you're right about home that. by yourself. In a state where weed's legal, you got to, you know? Yeah, yeah. I normally don't. Normally, I'm working on Friday, so I take advantage of it when I can. Oh, what a what a princess taking his uh, birthday off! Wow, good for you. Um, <laughs> did you like so? What I wanted to get feedback from you on is when you went back and watched, and we'll get to it. Is where you went all zombie. Like, how was that yeah. watching that like secondhand, not really knowing that it was going on at the moment? Because it's that that was really funny. Um, it it was difficult to watch, and actually, um, I saved that part to I watched like clips of it, like seconds of it. And then I would go back and and do other edit other parts. So it was it was difficult to watch just because it was like I don't know I was it was genuine hurt, genuine pain, yeah. genuine yeah. misery. Uh, so okay, let me ask and it you was this: like, before it. you yeah. finished it and you got like put on the wall or whatever at that other location, right? That's you, right. Yeah. So I have I have think, finished this challenge before, so what do you but think I didn't. The difference I didn't have what was it takes just the moment. Day. The moment when that guy won, you were like, "Fuck this." Uh, sort of, um, I didn't quit and, and for a couple of reasons, one, because yeah, you're right. If he, if he like whatever pukes or if he mm -hmm. takes a drink or like something happens and he gets DQ'd, then, then he's no longer the winner. And so there has to be a winner. So I didn't want to quit. And then also I, I wanted to complete the challenge for the so stream wait, for the, so for this, if, for he the if he pukes, he's not the winner. Well, in this, there was pointed out specifically in this contest. It was. <laughs> I'm just no. For the record, though, if he pukes, he's not the winner. That's that's what we're saying. I, right. For this contest okay. in particular, okay. it was no, specifically I don't, I don't need pointed all this. out. Just, just yes, Corey. Yes or no. <laughs> <laughs> uh, it also said, you know, the other thing is that I noticed is between that first video of you with. Uh, the kids and then this one was that mm -hmm. it really looked like they caked on the sauce on these like it just looked like it was layers more sauce than what you had to get on the wall or whatever yeah it, it was and i thought about that and uh if if the sauce had been different for each of the other contestants i i would have taken more i would have taken issue with that but no no i think from it was, what i, I could think it was tell, the same the for everybody was, I'm just i mean saying, it like, was more than the last time sure yeah, that's what I'm saying. But it I'm was just, everybody like, I had think, the same i don't think they were fucking you specifically what i'm saying is that it just seemed like they really caked on the sauce for this contest they did. Yeah, they did. Which is fine. I mean, you know. Whatever. Yeah, and and I'm I'm not going to point that to why I didn't do it, but yeah, they did. And and I would and you know what? I would expect them to. Yeah, I mean, you got to like especially if everybody's there watching, like you got to you got to at least show up to be like, "Hey, mm -hmm. nah, hell no. Nah. One person's going to well, win yeah. and the other people are going to cry." <laughs> They wanted people to have fucked up zombie reactions, and guess what? Oh. <laughs> they got what they wanted. That was my favorite. What? So, what was your reaction when you watched back on it? Because I was telling you about, it and you're like, "Yeah, I don't really remember that." And then, because you know, in the moment, like, how could you? You know what I mean? Like, I know well, even when you're doing comedy, like, you don't really remember the performances when you're in the sure. moment. You know. Well, what I do remember is that I am, um, um, like, uh, audio wise, I was aware of everything. I could hear everything. I could hear the MC. I could hear the crowd. I could hear the guy winning the contest. So I knew it, but I was kind of like, um, I don't know, in kind of in a daze for sure. Yeah. Um, 
one of the things that was, uh, <laughs> was, was probably the weirdest is, uh, you can see it when I actually kind of come out of it. Like I kind of open my eyes yeah, and yeah. I'm like, Oh shit. I'm kind there's of, a, there was a definitive moment when I was watching it live last week, there was a definitive moment where they said, that's it. And you could just see the fucking relief on your eyes that you don't have to keep trying. Like I've never, <laughs> like I've never seen that in you. Like, like usually if you don't do what you're trying to do, there's a look of like disappointment. Right. Sure. But I don't even feel there was that with, it would just look like sheer relief. <laughs> yeah well i was gonna say too there is so i had the gopro right on in front of me and so there was never a point when you know i i could hear what was going on but there's never i never got to a point when i was unaware that i was live streaming on the internet yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> you know like it just but i was but i was to a point when i didn't give a fuck you know like, well, I like those arms like I mean? those arm <laughs> stiffing and stuff that's just physical reaction there was nothing you could yeah. do about that that was just your body like hey hey fucking idiot stop throwing poison down our gullet dumbass Exactly. Exactly. And I did want to tell you tell you this too, Corey. I told Mikey this, but um, I was also aware, a cognizant of the entire time that under no circumstance, Curtis, are you allowed to puke live on stream? Yeah. Because yeah. Yeah. Oh yeah. <laughs> I oh, know oh, yeah. that. Oh yeah. I mean, I could I could live down. I would down love to lie. I would love to lie. I would, down, I would love. Completing. I would, I would love, never live down puking on stream. I would love. So I, like, I would love to lie. Option. I would love to lie to you and say I wouldn't use that against you, but it would be an absolute lie. I mean, it's it's. You've already puked sure. on like you've already puked on camera a few times though, so it's just par for the course. I mean, <laughs> if anything, like I would say puking on camera is kind of your gimmick at this point. <laughs> oh, come I think, on. I think you I think you did I think you did the fans a disservice by not puking. They watch your calling card, dude, because you got the, yeah. the granny thing and you got then you got the mac and cheese thing or whatever it was. I mean, like I it's like the I, buzz and the and the, you've seen that clip from from the movie and Vince McMahon, he's gonna puke. Yeah. Dear <laughs> God, he's gonna puke. It's not a bad Vince McMahon. <laughs> <laughs> I just I just like for me I think it's just like your gimmick and I just like I have watched well, you puke more than girlfriends I dated in college. No, I, I wouldn't I'd say that's a bit of a stretch, but I will say that um sucking and losing at these events is kind of my gimmick. And I remember I, I, was like, sucking, I didn't read man. through I much thought, of the chat, I but honestly, I honestly like um, like all that but I did I, I think it was Scruffy said, you know, I don't think I've ever seen Curtis win a challenge. I'm like, you know what? <laughs> that's, that's very true. Very observant. It's, I, I, I honestly like I will say this is that like, yeah, I don't I don't like I don't give a shit. Like, it's fun to like bust your balls and stuff. But like, you know, I don't think you handled yourself. Like, I think the fact that you got down to like one or two left. I mean, you you almost finished that fucking plate. And, you know, the, the people on the Internet that are going to give you shit for that, like fucking. OK, cool. Let's see your fucking plate of fucking wing dome wings, dick bags. Well, and I, I will say I, I did get a shot of the other contestants' plates, most of them, and um, not that there was a prize or any official second place, you but like I, second I, I think third, it was a yeah. second place. Finish. I, I couldn't tell because the, the fuck that fucking angle, that sun fucked the whole thing up. But it the, did. The it like did. Uh, from the angle I was watching, like worst case scenario, third, best case second. I mean, nobody else. Like, there's that one. There was one other plate that looked kind of close, and then everybody else had like four fucking wings left. It's like you weren't even. You got yeah. like one wing in, and we're crying about it. Well, there was there was two guys that quit, two yeah. guys that full on quit, and they quit like the, uh. the one dude quit after like not even one wing. Yeah, like there's one dude, there's the, one dude that got like I, I want to say it was like half a wing or maybe it was like one and a half wings, but he he got almost no way in and he just quit. And I was like, what the fuck? Why is that guy even here? The girl quit too. The one that who is and you'll it, it's so cringe. She goes and technically I'm the third best woman's ranked eater in the world. Like sh what does that mean? Technically, I'm what you either yeah. are you ranked or are you not ranked? I think it officially? just means I think it just means that she only uh, acknowledges two other female eaters. <laughs> that could be, but yeah, she quit too. And then the guy that won, and then the guy next to me, the guy you'll see him. He's in the blue next to me, mm -hmm. um, and he 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 put down like five and and he was chill the whole time and so that dude can handle some some spice um but yeah i don't know the, the other dude that other the pro the other pro eater that was there i didn't see his plate but i don't think he put down as many as i did he may How have are these though. guys like because you have this little visiting section earlier where you're like interacting like where's everybody pretty cool or like were they dicks because like one of those dudes looked like he was an absolute dick bag Oh yeah, and it was funny because I didn't say it at the time on the stream, but those 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 guys were husband and wife, and they were the two you know professional um, competitive eaters. And I didn't say it at the time, but they sure came across as arrogant, and everybody else in the chat thought so also. So yeah, like, they were. I mean, they were cool to talk to. I wasn't gonna be rude to them, but yeah. you know, they but they they yeah they came across as kind of douchebags, for sure. Yeah, and if you're saying they're douchebags, that's pretty douchey. And, and yeah, and John, like absolutely, the pot, yeah. The guy like the next pot to me, calling he, the kettle I, a douchebag. 
he was slow and steady and i thought he was going to have it and the one thing you'll notice is the guy next he didn't have any sauce on his beard or in his mouth or on his hands he was doing it super slow and steady and clean uh which is the way to go i think the i went like thing, in it like a barbarian and got that, sauce all over yeah me. i think the biggest thing that i noticed too is like even though you didn't make it past that last wing i think like the biggest thing is even if you had made it past that that last wing you would have had another 30 seconds of licking sauce off yourself absolutely and that's the worst part yeah. i know from experience <laughs> oh yeah but this could do you can't see it in this angle how much did that hurt just, your hands I mean, having the sauce all over them like that though that um yeah you can't see in this angle but the dude that won he licked the plate clean dude he i have the there's footage of it of him licking i'm like dude and then i i actually he and i got in touch on instagram after the fact and i was like dude you you absolutely fucking killed it because he was calling i you can see it on the timestamp. um he is uh he's calling for a wing check at like 245 <laughs> so into the into it so he had already eaten i mean obviously he still had to clean uh, eat the bones clean but he was calling like he had finished all of his wings at like 245 three minutes so he fucking crushed it dude and so i had i, I told him afterward uh, yeah absolutely well deserved john says yeah the place had a video where it showed him licking the plate find find me that john find me that clip I, that's crazy i would make curtis do it but it's his birthday and you like to do this weird like i've got i made a short of it here i'll i can i'll send you the link all right i like this too this was also one of my favorite parts was uh this just like zen moment of you realizing what you're about to do to yourself oh just a second speak for themselves here i can do this Oh yeah, no, I was, dude, I was a bit of a, I wouldn't, I don't there, know. Now it's live in Discord, I, so you don't have to deal with the delay. Oh, what'd you, oh, you put it in the Discord? Yeah, that way, like, because if I, if I put the okay, video hell live yeah. in Discord, okay, nice. it doesn't Thank delay you. over the thing. Yeah. That works. So yeah, there's just this moment, like, right here that I was just laughing at, because, like, look at, look at this. Like, you, you understand what you're about to do, and it's like, for all your fucking big little, like, yappy yap about wanting to be here, there did seem to be a calm before the storm where you were like, what the fuck am I doing? No, well, the thing was, dude, because I had a unique perspective on this because yeah, this challenge done it. fucked me up before. Yeah. yeah, I won, but it fucked me up for hours, and and I knew it was going to happen again, possibly worse. And I think so, that's the thing that really was, like really gains me a lot of respect for you is the fact that like you knew how much this was going to suck, and you still did it. You know, that's the cool. Yeah. Thing. Anybody, any idiot can get in there and fuck themselves up once or twice on something, but to really know how bad it is and be like, God damn it, I have to do this again. And then to do it on the internet where everybody has seen you puke, so you can't do that or they'll know that you're a... Uh... <laughs> yeah, well, plus there's like a lot of game mode too. Like I I, I was psyching myself yeah. up in my head and yeah. you know that people have their own way of doing things like that. Uh, but that's, I mean, obviously it didn't work for me, but that's what I've done in the past. And in that on top of a little, there was certainly some anxiety going on. Maybe it's time to get a different hat. Maybe that's just an unlucky eating hat. It <laughs> could be. Yeah, you're maybe around something there. Like I'll say this oh, every time. Every time I've seen you lose a contest, you're wearing that hat. I know. Maybe I need to, to retire it. Uh, I did DM you a link of that short though, so oh, you don't yeah, have to pull right. it up now. But that's I sent it. We're over on the. Oh yeah, there it is. Here, hold on. We'll pop it right now. Okay. So. Oh shit! Yeah. Uh -huh. Oh my god! Look at look at those though. Fuck. Like, see what I'm saying though? It looks like there's way more sauce on it than it was before. Yeah. Like when you had that one video of you doing it, like there were not, it was not caked like this. And again, it's fine that like all, as long as all of them are equal, I don't give a shit, right? Like if they, uh -huh. if it was just like your plate looked like that and everybody else's looked like what you used to do, like I'd be like, whatever. So let's, you know what? Actually, here, we'll, we'll do this in a sec. We'll go back to the, I want to watch this. Yeah, because first. that's going to have some spoilers. Yeah, 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 but. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> But it is cool seeing the other angles because, uh, and I do regret that I didn't, um, I don't know, there was a guy, I cut it out in the video of it that we're watching, um, but there was a guy that adjusted the the GoPro, and I thought that he was, um, that he would take into account the sun, and so yeah. I thought it was good, but it's just, no, it's it just, just sucks. it just sucked because the sun moved, like you're saying, and it's like, by the time it's like, it just sucks, because it, was, it yeah. was a good, it was a good <laughs> angle, and it like, the sun... It, and the the thing was, if Every, I had been like the Catholic, one to my like left, the, one to my like right, it would have been different. It's like the Catholic Church. It was fucked by a son. Yeah. And honestly, wow. I wasn't taking it to... I, I don't know. I I think that had I sat... I, I, of course, I had no way of knowing who yeah. was going to win. Yep. But had I sat down next to the guy who won yeah I th just being head to head well, with i think them, that yeah no, for sure for sure things, i think but. i think i think part of the problem is you were wedged between two really big losers <laughs> yeah it was, it was, 
Like yeah. the one dude tapped out immediately, and the other guy was like, he, like I'll give him credit for this. He like had the heart to keep going, but the pace that he was setting was not never going. Like neither of the people next to you looked like they were setting a pace that could win it. And I think yeah. that like being around that, you know, you play down to your competition. I think that if you were next to the guy and watching him crush, you would have been like, oh shit, I have to step it up. It, whether I, or not, but you I know agree. what? But here, but here's the flip side of that, right? I think you might have also puked had that been the case. That's the thing. Well, it's possible. It's possible. Yeah, because I mean, know. like, you're putting yourself in a like competitive mode. You know, it's 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 honestly the, it's the exact reason why I don't play fucking basketball anymore. I used to love playing basketball as a kid, and now like mm. anytime I pick up a pickup game, I get myself fucked up because I don't. My brain doesn't realize that I'm a fucking forty two year old man. You know what I mean? It's yeah. It's jumping on the hardwood for fucking rebounds like I'm fucking twelve. You know? Right. Look at that pump up though. All right, let's <sighs> fucking do this. No, that the anxiety takes me back as much as the spice takes me back. Seriously, dude. Yeah. Here's where I meet the guy. That's the guy that crushed it. Uh, yeah. The, well, the guy there in the center in the white shirt is the guy. Well, he, he's the guy who won. And you know what's funny? Everybody else is like acting all this whatever. That guy's just sitting in the back, just quietly taking it in too. He knows what he's about to fucking unleash dude, on you, okay, motherfuckers. So later, he was totally doing. He came in with a game plan and he executed and yeah. and he he crushed it. He he talks about it here in a bit, but he's an athlete. He's like a marathon runner. Yeah, and uh, and I know that now because I because like I said, he and I have been communicating on Instagram. I saw his page, um, but he came into it as though he were coming into a race and um, and he hyped himself up and he's like, I'm just gonna go balls the fuck out and then and <laughs> try to go for it. And he executed it uh, perfectly. Sure. Um, so yeah, I guess that's how I was saying before. It's completely respect for me because he, yeah, he deserved it. See, and that guy's just laughing because he's like, "I'm about to beat the fuck out of these pros." Yeah, I know. That it, yes, exactly. And you know something else? He was. He's uh, quietly. He's quietly. On, he's quietly. Him, like, he's quietly confident. Yes, exactly, exactly. And uh, but I, I talked to him later, and he was eat. He had a stick of butter, and he was eating uh, from a stick of butter. I'm like, okay, this, this guy, he he might be onto something here. Watch what I watch this parkour. Listen to what I say here after. Right. Jobber. Jobber. <laughs> <laughs> okay, this is deep enough. Who's this fucking jobber? Okay, perfect. I might sit there. I'm not sure. We'll see. This all the they haven't put my name on the one yet. So, did they assign you seats? No, uh, well, that's what was kind of odd. No, not really. So, I, sure. I guess you could just kind of sit wherever you want. But I thought they were going to assign them, so I didn't want to assign myself. Sure. Hi there, Curtis. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. And Sarah, I got it. Yeah, nice to meet you as well. Nice to meet you. Yeah. yeah, they were husband and wife. They were oh, professional they just, ears. They just I, both look insufferable. Yeah, they, her, they were. Look at the, the way she's cringy. like. First off, first off, look at this motherfucker. Here, I'll move my head. Look at this motherfucker and his fucking like magic marker on goatee, right? A. Yeah, I know. So cringe. And B, like this fucking woman can't even hide her bitch face long enough to say hello. Yeah. Like, watch this when you're like, oh, hey, because he's like, yo, what's up? Like, he, like, the way he approaches you is like, oh, this guy will want to meet me too. You know what I mean? Like, this, you know what this reminds yeah. me of is, uh, Every now and again in comedy, you'll meet these road headliners who have done fucking uh -huh. nothing, and then they right. come up to you when you're featuring and like, oh, I'm the headliner, and you're like, whatever, dude. Yeah. You know what? I hadn't thought of it that way, but you're right that he it probably was. He thought I was like some fan marking out. Yeah, that's what something. they are. Yeah, they all they like people like that, especially like like in my in my experience, right? The people uh -huh. who are like that low level of accolades, like so like the professional eaters you've never seen on TV, or like the headlining comics that are like road guys that you've never seen on like fucking, you know, the movies or anything like that, right? Yeah. Those are the people that are always like, Oh, I want to fucking like Mark Mercutio comes to mind. Like just that's those are the guys that are like, Oh, you probably want to meet me and hang out with me i'm the headliner like fucking shut the fuck mm -hmm. up dude but watch like right. watch the way this dude like greets you and then more importantly watch his wife and the way she's like she's trying so hard to be nice but she can't even force it past her fucking weird ass like fucking penguin skin face to like act like she's happy yeah they seem very inauthentic to me right right watch and then like see right there he's like he's like looking and he waits for you to make eye contact and then he just leans over with his fucking gerbo jean shorts and he's like what's up brother <laughs> He was a yeah, I'm not sure. We'll see the the they haven't put my name on the one yet. Like, see, like, oh, this guy wants to meet me. Like, shut the fuck up, dude. Like, 
What's yeah. up, bro? Yeah, I think you forgot to mention tight Jerbo jean shorts. Oh, look at, look at those. Loser. They're fucking hemmed. <laughs> Holy fuck. Look at that. They're hemmed. He's got oh, cuffs, dude. Shit. He has fucking cuffs on his jean shorts. Oh, man. And what? A tattoo of a line? He has a line tattoo? <laughs> That's a guy who, like, he showed up at the tattoo parlor and he's like, I want this giant fucking phoenix. And the tattoo artist got one line. He's like, oh, stop. It hurts. Quit it. Ah. Yeah, and plus, like you can't really tell, but the dude's like five foot five or something like that. Oh, this dude is kind of, a, no. Yeah. I can I can tell based on where his hand position is to shake your hand. <laughs> yeah, you timber folk <laughs> motherfucker. <laughs> All right, listen, watch, listen to the way he's like. He goes over like, hey, and then like, how much this dude spent more time prepping his goatee than he did eating wings. Just let that sink yeah, in. And he's the professional eater. You know, this is the thing that I, I feel like fucking Joey Chestnuts doesn't fucking get enough credit for. That dude shows up to every event and he looks like he just rolled out of bed because he mm -hmm. doesn't give a fuck about anything but eating the most he can as quickly as he can. He does not right. give a fuck about anything else. Uh huh. All right, so watch this dude. Oh, I already hate this guy. Hi there, Curtis. Nice to meet you. Nice to meet you. He's not even making eye contact. He's like this. Oh, do you want to meet me? Hi. And like, as you're shaking his hand, <laughs> he already starts looking away, dude. Fuck this guy. Watch. Look at his eyes. Look at his yeah. fucking eyes. <laughs> oh, I got to shake this dude's hand with my fucking red fucking iPhone, which is like, what, two cameras? So that's probably might even be as old as my iPhone. He's giving me the side eye. <laughs> yeah. But watch how he goes like mid. He's like, hey, how's it like he forces the introduction on you and then he can't even be bothered to see it through. <laughs> watch. He makes eye contact. Oh, hey, buddy. And then like watch as you're shaking his hand halfway through. He looks away. What's up, brother? Hi there. Curtis. Nice to meet you. Nice to he's not even looking. His eyes are closed. <laughs> like, hey, nice to meet you, whoever you are. I can't. You know, you know what it is? You know what it is? It's guys... for, for him, he's like, I can't get to know these guys because I'm gonna fucking murder them. You never you, you never know... name a farm animal that you're about to slaughter, <laughs> Curtis. That's just that's that's Midwestern 101. Yeah, no doubt. No, it's funny because I knew these guys were douchebags, but now that you're breaking it down, I'm like, holy fuck, these guys suck. <laughs> right. <laughs> and I knew I knew all this by two things: jean shorts with a hems and a backwards <laughs> ball cap. Yeah, I, dude, yeah, you're for not my money, for my get money, the fuck yeah, out of for here. my money. Nothing has ever like demonstrated somebody being a douchebag than having their hat backwards. Right. I don't know why that like I've met in my entire life. I think I've met like maybe five people that were cool that wore their hat that way. Maybe. And most of the time those people didn't even wear hats. But if that's your look like this is this is a fun. I love this is this, you can take this home. This is for everybody. Here's a birthday present to you, Curtis. Okay. Okay. There are little things people do in this world that are red flags and they'll tell you everything you want to know. Right. Mm -hmm. wearing your hat backwards is one of them, right? If you wear your hat backwards, you are basically saying, I'm too cool to wear a normal hat, but I'm too insecure to not wear a hat. That's what wearing your hat backwards says. And, that, and I'm not talking like, I'm not talking like- dumb enough to think it looks cool. Right, well, but, but that's where they're like, look at, look at this, I'm wearing a hat. Like if it's cocked to the side and they just think it's gangster, I'm even willing to escape that. I'm, I'm willing to say, you know what, fine. If that's a stylistic choice that I don't necessarily like, but fine. But hat straight backwards like that, always a douchebag. The other one, so, and this you can take home with you, is owning a goddamn bird. I swear to God, anybody, <laughs> dude, I swear to God, if you meet, like, if you're, a bird if, on it. oh, dude, if you're ever on, like, a dating site, anybody, if you're ever on a dating site, and that man or that woman has a bird, you swipe left immediately, and you fucking block <laughs> them, and as you're sitting here, yeah. like, think to yourself this, how many people have you known in your life that own a bird, Curtis? Just, just rough number, no, no wrong answers. Yeah, I don't know, four or five. Sure, I guarantee you those four or five people are the craziest fucking people you've ever met in your life. <laughs> They are a different. They are right. a different. Because here's the thing about bir birds, right? Like this is why birds are always a red flag. What What is the only thing a bird brings to the table? What does a bird do? Don't overthink it. No wrong answer. The first. Yeah, some of them talk. I don't know. Nope. What, what does a bird know for? <laughs> what, what What do birds do? Birds fly. There you generally. go. There you go. Fly. Right. Their number one trait is that they fly. Right. And the first yeah. thing you do when you own a bird is you clip its fucking wings so it can't fly and you throw it in a fucking cage. Yeah, that is. There's a moment of broken narcissism that goes into owning a bird that you cannot replicate. 
if you own a bird and that bird was not like something like, no, I'm not talking like if you had a great aunt that died and she left you a bird that was hers, that's a little different. You know what I mean? You're like, ah, I don't really fucking like this bird, but I have to fucking take it. But if you, if you're the kind of person that goes out there and gets a bird because you like owning a bird, you're a fucking monster. And I challenge anybody, anybody in chat, do you know a bird person that isn't crazy as fuck? Because you don't. I guarantee it. The same is true with backwards hat wearing motherfuckers. They're the fakest, stupidest, narcissistic people with nothing to like that's the thing about this guy this guy is a professional food eater you know what that means that means that once he got paid his meal and a t-shirt for winning a contest and tells people he's a pro that's what that means yeah 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 and that's that's you know i'll tell you what that's a, a word that i never say on myself i say i i'm an occasional competitive eater Com yes that's true but yes. i'm not professional i would never right. tell somebody that i am you talk me into it. I need a bird now. I thought you had many birds, Mr. Approachable. That's how much you suck. I do you, thought you Corey, do you mean birds. like even the small ones too? Like the yes. tiny ones? No, I'm telling you this. It's it's a it's a it's a it's a faculty of the personality. If you mm. want if you want to own this creature and you know that you have to take away the only thing it does to own it, it, it subconsciously, there's a level of narcissism that just cannot be remedied. Like that, like bird owners are made of red flags. I swear to God, if I ever like, yeah. like back when I was on a bunch of dating sites, like back years ago, if I saw a bird anywhere left, I don't give a fuck if it's like the hottest chick that had fucking everything I look for bird owner, get the fuck out of here. Yeah. Well, you know, I will admit when I was in high school, and this is, you know, late nineties, early two thousands, that backwards hat deal was kind of popular. I rocked that one for a few years there, but you know, most people grow out of it. This guy didn't. But you're also a fragile narcissist. That's why you're doing YouTube videos. Same with me. I mean, that's that's the performance aspect, right? You're at least honest with who you are and you grew out of it. This guy and my hat's on forward now. <laughs> this guy, like, you're not you're not showing up at competitions, fucking half-ass introing yourself to people while you can't even pay attention to them saying, Hey, how are you? While your fucking lizard-skinned woman can't even crack a real smile while she tries to sip on her Bud Light so nobody notices that her tits hang well below her knees at this point. Yeah. You know, one of the you're spot on. The, the other thing that would just annoyed me about these people and and it just made me cringed also was that they were already writing the narrative for their defeat before the competition yes. even started. Because they you know, knew they, they were weren't going to well, win. They we knew. are competitive right. eaters. Right. We're not uh, spicy people. Right. You'll hear them talk about it they in a knew, minute. They knew they weren't going to win. And so they yep. weren't going to try. So they had to let Absolutely. everybody know they weren't going to try, but they had to be there to shake hands because people want to see the professional eaters. Fuck this dude. Now yes. watch, watch. So first off, that's Can't exactly make... what happened, Corey. Yeah. Yeah. No, I'm, I, dude, I don't know if you know this or not, but I am very, very good at reading people. It's like one of my superpowers. Yeah. It makes me a very good comedian. I can walk into a room and I can tell you what people will find funny just based on their mannerisms and who they are. It right. also makes me well, pretty good at poker. I can tell what people have in their hands typically. And, and, you know, to a different degree, I mean, I've worked in sales for a yes. long time and it's, it's, it's different, but you, I've, I, <laughs> I can do that as well to a, to a degree. If you're in sales, man, best book ever, Spin Selling, dude. That that book changed my life when I was in sales. That shit's great. Oh yeah. Oh yeah, that's a that's a uh, that's the best sales book ever written in my opinion. Nice. I'll yeah, the, into that. the big the big thing is uh, under promise, over deliver. That's the, how you spin it. <laughs> John says Corey can see to people's souls, then he steals it. Yeah, but the moment I look into people's <laughs> souls, half of them I don't even want the souls. I'm like, oh, you can keep that. Like this <laughs> like, guy, okay, I'm looking enough. into yeah. this fucking no, Jerbo cufflink motherfucker, and I'm like, you can <laughs> yeah. keep it. Look at his tiny little. I've skipped every leg day I've ever seen. Oh legs. no, shit, dude. And now watch, now watch. Okay, so then again, he can't even be bothered to make eye contact and continue the conversation. It's like a 30 second. But more importantly, pay attention to what a fake smile and fake person this person. Like these people showed up and this was like the, the media, like they, they want to like get the fucking red carpet treatment. Yeah, so they're just, exactly. they're just fake people that don't deserve a level of fame that they feel they're entitled to. Fuck these people. This is, mm -hmm. this is every road hack headliner I've ever seen. That's what yeah. these people are. Watch again the way he like, literally look at him. Look at the way he's looking at you before he even talks to you. He's like, oh, yeah. I better preemptively say hi to this guy. That's what he's thinking in his head. This guy, yeah. this guy wants to talk to me because he likes to eat. You know what I mean? Like that's like, well, you know, one thing that's interesting too is I was mentioning that uh, the guy who ended up winning it, winning it, I was uh, talking with him on Instagram, and he said that he had already seen my video before. So, <laughs> hold on, hold on, uh, one, the one of the wing dome uh, one. Bird collector, and, bird collector just wrote, "I just want to put it out there. I do not collect animal, real or fake <laughs> birds." <laughs> well, I mean, that screen name says otherwise. Yeah, I don't. Know. I feel like he feels like he might have been under attack a little bit. <laughs> uh, funny. 
Um, but so I was going to say though, it's possible that this guy knew who I was that, or he had seen my video and knew, or right. it's possible. Right. But he, like, he literally, like, he can't even be bothered to play it fake for you when you don't care. Like what yeah. he's trying to do is he's trying to gaslight you into being like, Hey, you should care who I am. And then ignoring you to seem cooler. Cause these kind of people, it's always the same thing, right? They have to ignore you because if they spend too much time around you, you'll realize what a fucking toolbox they are. It's a very mm -hmm. base like uh, trick that a lot of people, the, the cool kids like in high school used to do this shit all the time. where like the most insufferable bastards would just hang around looking cool. Cause they're all GQ and they'd be like, yeah, Hey, what's up? Cool. And then they just walk off or whatever, because if they stood there and had a conversation more than three sentences, you you realize this guy might need a fucking helmet yeah no shit all right watch watch this watch this guy and then watch this lady's reaction oh, okay. What's up, brother? hi there curtis nice to meet you nice to meet you and sarah i got it yeah, nice to meet you as well nice to meet you. Yeah. <laughs> did you see that like 10 seconds of a fake smile and now they're both looking away from you okay Okay, dude, honestly, honestly, I, I, I edit this down. There was about eight seconds of silence there. And it was a little <laughs> bit of awkward after this, but I edited it down so it looked like it was like a clean cut. You should have like kept it but in it there. Kept that in there. You should have kept that in there. That's hilarious. <laughs> I'm going to watch this one more time. So, I might sit there. I'm not sure. But we'll see. This all the they haven't put my name on the one yet. What's up, brother? Hi there. Curtis. Nice to meet you. <laughs> nice to meet you. He didn't even say his fucking name. He goes, oh, hey there, brother. How that. is it? And you're Curtis. It's nice to meet you. And then just looks like, didn't even fucking introduce himself. Oh, dude, dude. I'm not, you're breaking the shit down, man. I didn't even notice that. Watch. He's like, he leans over, forces an introduction, and then doesn't even introduce himself. Oh. Fuck and, this And dude. you know what? And, I, and to her, I said, you must be Sarah. Because it was the only girl's name that was on the cards. Yeah. So I said, you must be Sarah. She didn't introduce herself either. <laughs> Interesting. <laughs> Hey, uh, I know you're not busy right now, but uh, do you care if I lean over and not introduce myself to you? Also, I love to fucking have cuffs in my jean shorts. <laughs> and, and I like this angle because I can show off my line tattoo. Also, do you like these shoes? I got them uh, at Payless. <laughs> they're fucking, uh, they're Air yeah. Jordans. Knock off Jordans. <laughs> Hi there, Curtis. Nice to meet you. Oh, and by the way, his shirt nice is to meet his you. own. Yeah, his and he's shirt wearing, is his own logo. And, and he's wearing his own fucking logo. I don't. Do I yeah, need any yeah. more off this dude? What is this? No, no. You know what? Hold on. What? The, what is this dude's fucking name? Uh, his first name is Juan, and it says uh, um, Juan. What, what do you it? know? No, no. I. Um, you might show on his shirt, but it's uh, whoa. One oh, more what? bite. One more bite. Like it. No. Oh, like God, his name okay. Juan yeah, I got more you. bite. I got you. Shut up. I Put got Juan more bite Seattle. Yeah, yeah. I'm doing but spell that. Juan right. I did. Isn't that how you spell? No. U A N. There you go. Whatever. I don't speak your moon language. Oh my God. Is okay. that him? Yeah, but check this out. His site is on Weebly. Oh shit! That's his. That's him. Yeah. This guy is not a professional eater. You know what it well, is? This is what happened. This guy got into one sanctioned major league eating event and says he's a pro. So he probably, what happened is he probably got in when they were doing open invitations for Nathan's and then used that to get an MLE card because there's a bunch of people that did that. Hmm. Like, so I don't know if you know this or not, but like there was a point, uh, it was like right when Joey started winning, it was like third or fourth win, right? It was when MLE yeah. first started coming in and they were trying yeah. to do this major push for the promotion. So what they yeah. did is they lowered the entrance uh, things for Nathan's and then anybody that was in Nathan's had a free ride to get their MLE card. I bet this guy is at fucking trash. This is our goal. We're yeah. going to train you to beat him. Look at this fucking website. Terrible. Okay. Bio and press. Let's see his fucking... Oh, wow. Look at that. This is his bio and press page, dude. Notice how it's nothing but just him with some hot dogs. What? Um, check out... Hold on. I thought I saw his Instagram on there, too, on the Google search. I don't give a shit about that right now. So that's him with, like, some that, hot dogs at home. That looks like a long time ago. Yeah, but this is his website, dude. Oh, shit. This is literally what happens when you click on bio and press. Like, <laughs> you see this? This is his site. Oh, 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 there's an about there. Right. No, no. About. Bio and press. Hold on. Okay. So here's. That's that's 2012. 11 years ago. Right. And that's it. Look at this. Not only is that 11 years ago, the, the link doesn't even work. It just goes to CBS News. This one doesn't work. 
This one doesn't work. <laughs> oh for three. Hey, Travel <laughs> yeah. Channel has this. You know, what's funny about this is that it says attempts. It doesn't say they did. It says it has a watch button there, too. Oh, my God. Sorry, we're doing a deep dive on this piece of shit. <laughs> Dialpad's no AI sales has completely oh, transformed. Oh, sweet. Dialpad, bro. AI is built right in with live coaching. Nobody cares. Oh, what's this all about? I don't know. Let's find out. Oh shit! You you know me, dude. You know me. What's I? This is this oh, is like shit. like I am, diving, I am the perfect. Dude. I like people don't. You guys don't fucking respect this because I don't brag about it all the time. I don't think you guys understand what a perfect mix of ADHD and autism I am as a human being. <laughs> like when I get singularly oh, focused man. on something like this, it's deep dive o'clock. This yeah, we're fuck gonna find all the rabbits, dude. Fuck this, dude. <laughs> all right, guys, we're here at the pub at the Monte Carlo lunch. Awesome. Yeah. Oh, Bert Kreischer. Oh, there's Juan. What the like fuck? It, Juan is an accomplished professional leader, currently ranked 21st in the world of 21st. So this would be 21st in like 2012 when the entire league was probably 40 people. Still impressive, like still still decent. Major league. Yeah. Meeting. Kyle, nice. God, I need you guys. I ordered his Where's his backwards hat? Cool yeah, absolutely. Awesome. I don't know, but he's still wearing his own shirt. Eight pounds. It's four pounds of burger, two pounds of bun, one pound of cheese, one pound of vegetables, and 32 ounces of beer. Kyle, Kim, and Bert have 45 minutes to finish their burgers. Damn, Bert's so much skinnier back then. Yeah, this is before he discovered just beer. Just under 25 yeah. minutes. Awesome. <laughs> and of course, off in my distance is my EMT. Yeah, so don't worry. Eat as fast as you can. He can say. This is when Bert's still had clothes. All I ask is you set the pace for us. We She's, watch him. Yeah, even fight, back fight. then, he's What's got this douchebag go uh, goatee uh, going on, huh? Don't eat it like a normal burger. Oh, yeah. I, eat the meat. I think maybe he can't grow real facial hair. I think that's the problem here. Or maybe he makes it look like it's, uh, it's, it's all thing. formed and lined. Yeah. I mean, that's what we're here for. Here's your burger. Oh, my God. <laughs> all right, that's oh pretty God. sweet. <laughs> Oh, that looks awesome! I'm gonna go for it. I'm just gonna go for she it. She normally and, uh, eats more than me too. In five, four. Oh, three, each person has to two, have the one. Oh dude, shit! Dude, he just put on a fucking headband that says "One More Bite." Okay, so if this guy kills us, I'll slightly respect him some no, more. No, I, I think I think th that he. Is, that's a lot. That's a big he, fucking I think that he burger, is. Dude. I think that he is actually a pro eater, or was at one point. I think that he. Again, I my, I suspect that he got in when the standards were real low. And he hasn't really done anything since, as proven by the website that hasn't been updated and the top three links being from 2012 and being dead. Yeah. One, begin. Wow, he is off to the races. Get that off. You don't need that. Yeah, going straight for the okay. straight for the meat. I was thinking more like a pizza one. How are you guys doing on yours? Oh my god, you guys are really. Connected. This is interesting. Okay. Yeah. I mean, that's Eight the move, minutes. right? You separate right. the meat from the bread. Oh yeah, no, absolutely. Yeah, it's just interesting that like we're watching a video on this dude. This is like, yeah, I love the deep dive. I love it. This is a good burger. Fucking Bert with his like fingernail portion. <laughs> He's literally just one tiny bite. How many people have competed? Two. Two people have actually Two people that completed the challenge. Looks like number three is going to be right here. How many calories? How many calories? About 11,000. 11,000 calories? Look at the fold. So, yeah, Are in the lettuce. Smart move. I just thought that it'd be fun to, to build a castle burger. of burgers. Yeah, and put some hair on it. Let's make a person out of your burger. <laughs> it's it's funny, like they're all having yeah, a casual everybody, conversation, everybody, yeah, joking around, else, and he's going to town on the fucking burger. Everybody else decided they can't do it, and he's like, I got to do this. This is what I'm here for. Yeah, <laughs> he's still in game mode. It's person. The competitive eater, I'm really offended by this. <laughs> I'm just throwing that out there. We can't walk out of here doing eight-pound burgers, but if I've been drinking since I was 14, let's do this. Oh, no. I guess he did know about beer back then. <laughs> kind he's of. got you das see, boot. You see that shit, though? Like, he spills it all over. He's like, I've been drinking since I was 14. And then spills it all over himself. <laughs> Some people just can't handle das boot. Classic Burt Kreischer right there. I've been drinking since I was 14. <laughs> Shut up, Burt. Doing eight-pound burgers. But if I've been drinking since I was 14, let's do this. Like, did you see how much he spilled on him? <laughs> yeah. I'm this sorry. Is the boot. You have to twist it. <laughs> I went up my nose. <laughs> Sorry. It went up my nose. Oh, shit. Oh, man. You got it, dude. You got it. What's the record? 24 minutes and 47 uh, seconds. Yeah. You got two minutes to kill that beer, Juan. 
Oh, oh you had to drink the beer, beer too. too. Crazy. Damn. All right. Well, I'll give I'll give credit where due. That's yeah, right. that's impressive. So definitely better than whatever. Okay. You know what? Look, I still hate him, but that's fine. Yeah. Yeah. No doubt. <laughs> but but yeah, credit where due. But again, hell. but again, like okay, so like that was that that was clearly a long time ago, right? Yeah. Like why that is was, he not uh, like, at least ten years ago? Yeah. So here's. This is 2013. This isn't okay, here. Okay, so it's one for f one for six. So one of for all seven. of his links, the only oh, one no, that's but there that about there is a right travel. Below? Well, we'll get to that. I'm just saying, oh, all oh, of okay. his links, he has. They're all from at least 2013 or before, and the only one that's there is Travel Channel because they kept the video. The article isn't even there. Let's see the about. Based out of Las Vegas, one more bite is a professional trainer by profession. Okay, cool. So that's oh yeah, I remember him talking about that. Yeah, competitive eater by disposition. Oh, do you see how clever wording that is? He's a personal trainer by profession, competitive eater by disposition. <laughs> Douchebag by choice. Uh, ranked twentieth in the world of competitive eating. So here's the link. What do you? What is the over under that he is still ranked twentieth? Uh, in Emily, I don't think uh, he Absol may not still be in it. He's likely Absol not on Absolutely there. Absolutely so. fucking not. That's my thing. Yeah. He's still a shorts wearing bird owning hat backwards douche canoe. That's right. Okay, here we go. So here's the rankings. There's some guy here. I've is that guy good? I've never heard of him. <laughs> oh, but hey, oh, since you got it up, that guy there, number two, Jeff Esper. Yeah. That's yeah. the guy I was mentioning in the chat when you're playing the. Yeah, he he's a gen certified badass also, but the perennial second place. Mickey, for, Mickey for Sudo is the one that's like fucking crazy to me. Like she had, there's like competitions where she beat Joey upright. It was fucking great. Mm. All right, Matt Stoney's at fifth now. He used to be way higher than that. James Webb, that guy number thirteen Weird. there, Steve. He's uh Steve the Rabbit. He's a local guy, local to me. Nice. I know. This I was kind of hoping he was going to be there. Guy. But... Oh, there he is, right yep. there. He's nineteenth. No shit. Okay. Okay. How about that? So here's something interesting, too. They don't even cite. So he probably just hasn't updated that site in forever. He probably just doesn't care about that site. <laughs> of course. Uh, let's see about. Slug Burger. <laughs> Just trying to look at his notable. That's what, yeah, that's actually what I was looking at here. We can go bigger. He's logged a string of impressive performances. Slug Burger, 23.5 in 10 minutes. Gyozas. But none of those are records. I mean, again, not to right. belittle that, but like he doesn't have any records. Okay, so look at this. That's interesting. 22 hot dogs in his qualifying attempt and debut. That's like barely enough to make it at this point, right? Yeah, I'm not sure what the threshold is there, but um, uh, yeah, I mean, so, like, so that's, the, his, that's the, his first qualifying attempt. So this is exactly what I said it was. He got in when it was lower bar because 22 ain't shit now. 22 used right. to be a thing. Like it used, I mean, fucking now we got fucking Joey Chestnuts. It's like, if you're not doing 70, you suck. Yeah, interesting. I'm surprised he's still on there, but um, there's his wife, 24. Oh, that okay, that is her. Interesting. Oh, remember what she said? She said, "I'm technically the number three ranked female." <laughs> well, I mean, that's not wrong. Uh, so there's two in front One, of her. Two. So that three. actually makes sense. What she was talking about then? Yeah. So she's talking about MLE ranking. She wasn't lying. She is technically the third, according to MLE. But she also, like, they don't have that British chick that's probably above her. Like, they don't have, like, there's a lot of better eaters that aren't in MLE. Not a lot. I shouldn't. Like, Absolutely. Like, let, me, let me rephrase that. I don't think there's a better eater out there than Joey Chestnut, right? Or Esper yeah. or Stoney or, like, Pseudo. But once you get past the top, like, 10, there's a lot of competitive eaters that are better than the MLE people in, in like, yeah. over in Britain and stuff like that. Not, not a lot, but, I mean, two or three here or there, you know? Yeah, so who knows and I don't know, not to, not to hate on it or anything like that, but I do think that some of these rankings are arbitrary. I mean, yeah. the what's the difference between 24 and 34 or 12 and 2? I don't know. Like, the top two, top five, maybe I can get, but anything beyond that, she I'm not sure 15, there's a whole lot of uh, merit famous to it. hot dogs in Fort Worth qualifier. In 2017. So if she's 2017 at 15 and they're not even giving his fucking like date that he did it, 
this had to be way earlier than that. So he's probably like 2012, 2010, he did the 22. But if you look like, I mean, you look at like, okay, so let's look at like Esper, for instance, right? Like mm-hmm. Here's a bunch of shit where it's like, he ate this. He has this record, right? Like chestnuts. It's just all, look at all these records. <laughs> God damn it. I always forget. Like, I don't forget, but it's just, I'm always blown away. <laughs> yeah. He's, but notice, the, but he's notice no, no records. Right. And notice her, no records. Is that common for people on that? Right? Yeah, maybe it is. Maybe outside of like 10, they just don't have records. Yeah. All right. Well, you know what? More legit than I thought, but I still hate him. How about that? Well, the, 10 years ago, legit, you know, yeah. <laughs> who knows what he's been up to since then. Uh, but I did hear him. Well, he was still, talking about because the, they were hyping those. They were hyping him and his wife up. This, quite site, a bit. this, this site is so old. It says he's 20th and he's actually above that now. John says, wow, she has 10 tattoos. Okay, well, whatever. Long story short, fuck him and fuck Yeah. Him. <laughs> no kidding. Nice to meet you. And Sarah, I gather. Yeah, nice to meet you as well. Nice to meet you. Yeah. Yeah. Literally, neither one of them asked your name. Yeah, nice, I know. nice to meet you. Okay, cool. Random guy with the hat. <laughs> okay, so what I'm going to do now, I'm going to, oh, pardon me, sorry. I'm going to hop on out of here and do a quick hot swap on the battery. We're down to 47% on this one. Uh, I've got another full charge battery. Going to do a hot swap here um, before we get going. If you if you are the kind to send some positivity my way, now is the time to do it in the chat, brothers and sisters. Don't pander, dude. Uh, no, yeah. that was the truth, man. I was like, I, I, I was getting the game. Oh, here he is again. Uh, okay. Right, here we go. Morning. Morning. I know. I heard I talked to that guy again. Dude, okay, so check this out, right? This guy is by himself in the zone. Yeah, I, yeah. Like big time. He like he doesn't give a shit about any of the fucking anything. He's there to eat some spicy fucking wings and he doesn't He was on a mission. Yep. Yeah, he and I actually had the same game plan. He just executed, you know, and I didn't. I That's... heard a rumor that uh, you're professional. Is that the case? We're professional eaters, eaters. Not, not, spice not spicy ones. ones. Eaters, not spice. Fuck I know. He gets all feminine with it. I mean, professional. He's like I said, he's already writing his narrative of why he didn't win. I heard win. a rumor that uh, you're professional. Is that the case? We're professional eaters, eaters. Not, not, spice not spicy ones. ones. Not okay. Not spice heads, not chili heads, eaters. Oh, I'm sorry. Wait, uh, okay, let me just ask you guys a question. Uh, does, is this guy going to shove these up his ass? Like, what do you fucking do? You <laughs> eat the fucking wings, asshole. Like, what the fuck? Oh, yeah, we're professional eaters, but just not this one food. We like to shove this straight up our fucking rectum. That's why I wore the cuffed up jean shorts. He looks like he looks like he looks like he's, he looks like he's taking a shit right now. <laughs> Over under that his wife pegs him. Oh yeah, th- I, there's no question. Oh, no. This, this is different. Okay, yes, it is different. We're, we're stepping out of our air. Our yeah. Area okay. Right yeah. Now. Cool. Well, I'll be a few down for you. I'm Curtis here, and so uh, yeah. Let's we'll see what happens. Yeah. Well, you finally got your name across. It only took two meetings. <laughs> Pray for our food. Yes, that. Oh, yes. Prayer. That's correct. Yes. We might start going funders there. <laughs> yes, that's right. <laughs> Is that Jesse Towler? It does kind of look like him, huh? Not like it looks. Oh, more- oh hey, hey. Oh, see this? Hey, hold up, hold, right there. That guy in the red shirt that says Ballard. Yeah. He was uh, the guy that was next to me on my right, and what he's doing, I didn't know. I didn't. I, I didn't know he was in the shot at the time, but what he's his approach there, and he's talking about it right now, was the Zen approach: is be totally chill and try to be one with the wing type of thing. And that's what he's talking about right now. Is just that I dude, noticed that in the that shot. It looks like there. if the Nasty Boys never wrestled. Yeah, there was some. The chat was hilarious with it. They were getting some funny shots in there the other day when I was playing this. That that guy totally looks like Jesse Towler. <laughs> I know. <laughs> I actually met that that guy that looks like Tyler uh, later that day, later that evening after the contest. Like a few hours later, I saw him walking around with his lady. I said, "Hey, weren't you in that contest?" And he's like, "Yeah, they kicked my ass." But he's the he ended up being the guy that that quits right away. <laughs> <laughs> the one one and done, got his ass. Yep. 
Yeah. Only two weeks in the Northwest. You know, you know, this is the same question. Hey, influencers, you can tag me on your videos too. Oh, you can tag him on your videos too. How nice of that guy. Hey, just so you know, you can tag me. <laughs> Cool. Get right on that dick bag. You know what's interesting is there were a lot of like, a, like I don't know, it, it's easy to shit on, shit on like people who are influencers or foodies and stuff like that. But there were like some legit like Seattle uh, foodie people there who put no, together some of the, the videos. No for such these. thing as a uh, legitimate food influencer, Curtis. Shut the fuck up. What, no such thing as a... <laughs> no, I, well, fair enough. Oh, I can smell it. <laughs> oh, I can smell it. Oh, this fucked me up e uh, immediately. See, this is what I'm saying. Look at how like thick that is on there like that's way thicker than that other one you ate yeah but right right away when they dropped it like i got like memory came back to me of the wings and like that that smell because it smelled the same as i remember and i was just like oh fucking I kinda like the way they spread it though go. with it like the one up and it kind of looks like a little lotus it's kind of cute yeah it's like a fucking uh sunflower. that's the seventh it's like, it's like a sunflower <laughs> of death oh, oh my god yeah. right behind you thank you oh, oh. There's that lady being a bitch right behind you. Thank you. <laughs> Pardon me. Shut up, bitch. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. <laughs> oh, you can see I've got the chat up. <laughs> I can smell it from. Oh, uh, but dude, this I could catch the vapor in my nose and uh, or in my eyes, and my eyes were watering before the contest even started, man. Yeah, it's duh, like... it's fucking hot wings, Curtis. Oh, I know. Okay. No, not like I don't know. Sure. These, well, not like anything else I've had. Oh man, we need to come out already. Really? Come on now. If you have the smell of it. Does it hurt your stomach watching this back? Uh, no, not my stomach, but but like I don't know. It just it does make it does bring back some of the uh, anxiety. I know exactly where it was. That was, was, that was my there. favorite. It's, that uh, was my favorite Snapchat from you. I think I've ever gotten was you just like looking absolutely mortified as you sit on the <laughs> train, realizing you might shit blood. Yeah, yeah, the train was rough. Do you think the train was harder than the contest? Well, no. Well, that's the thing. I mean, I, I, th I think I told you. That, yeah. What's interesting about this contest in comparison to the one that I did in 2020 was uh, the one in 2020 going at the wings at the time. It was they were hot, but the misery came the <laughs> afterward, the couple hours after mm -hmm. here. It was a little bit the reverse of that, where up front it totally fucked me up and it was still bad afterward, but it wasn't like miserable. I mean, it was bad, but not miserable. Do you think that's because you knew what was in store because you had already done it before? Uh, well, I did. I think a lot of that had to do with coating the stomach. Some that I did uh, yeah, yeah. in the video here, that the Pepto and the um, and the snacks and the and the yogurt and things like that. I think that had more to do with it, possibly. You've really come a long way. Yeah. Four minute warning, ladies oh, there and goes the hat. He's in the zone. Right at seven o'clock on the dot with some quick intros, and then of course you see. You're gonna crush thyroid Nick Swartzen over here. The hot wings of death coming out here. No, that's what that's what they're saying. Like Swartzen meets Chad Zumach or something like. It was yeah. something, I don't know. Lemmy was being really funny with it. I, what you said. I really like the guy's uh, Guy Fieri shirt behind you. <laughs> the MC. We're having a July seventh seven alarm wing eating challenge. Two minutes, everybody. Help. I fucking hate you. Don't write, don't put that in there. I had to adjust the color settings due to the sun. Nobody cares. Seattle, how you doing? How much time are you waste in the editing suite typing that up? Knock it off. <laughs> All right. We don't get started here. This actually look, was the first look, video I've edited look, on uh, it does with look, Da Vinci. I love Da Vinci. That's my favorite. I love yeah, how it's, it's free and you can do everything and then like, yeah. Did I tell you about DaVinci? Yeah, because I had I had Adobe for a long time, and I just uh, I think Towler did actually. Yeah, Towler's a big like predominant. He's the guy that got me on DaVinci. Like it's it's crazy, but yeah, the what's cool is like the color adjusting that you did. Like it already looks better than it did on the live stream. Yeah, for sure. Here's just another minute or so for y'all on the Argosy cruises. If you hear me, hello. We're gonna be having a seven alarm winging challenge. If you don't know, seven alarm is the hottest wing in the city if not i dare say the state in the country these are fire oh, zooming in good for you they have contestants have seven minutes seven wings
They have seven minutes to eat seven whole yeah, wings. Yeah, we know. They have seven uh, minutes to eat seven yeah. wings. Jesus Christ. This the 75 week uh, all the way. Oh my God. Oh, you have 70 there minutes to announce it. There we go. When you see the timer, it's starting. He's false started like a motherfucker. I was, so, I was like, come yeah. on. Are you ready? On three, two, one. I kind of want him to do the like three, two, one, Ghostbusters. Ah, ah, ah. <laughs> Begin! <laughs> All right, folks. Curtis Woo! is right in. Can I ask you a question? What's up? Why did you zoom in for this? You had a wider shot that had other people in, but you zoomed in for this part. Because I wanted to I wanted to crop out the sun. Oh, okay. Well, that's a rational answer. I wasn't prepared for that. On there yeah. after that 500 smack of rooms. Let's go, Sarah! It, it does. I move witch, it around some, doctor, especially so when I start a, kind of uh, freaking a, out. There's a place in Minnesota in St. Paul called D-Spot. It's the best wing place in all of Minnesota. And their, oh, no hottest, their hottest wing is called the Witch Doctor. I brought Kong uh, there. Kong ate the Witch Doctor, and I got a really hilarious Snapchat of him puking almost immediately. What city is it in? St. Paul. It's uh, it's it's oh. it's on the it's over by Smokedale. Like it's connected to the same mall that Smokedale's at. Huh. And it's awesome. The big thing is that they ship everything, and it's never frozen. It's the best. They are hands down the best wings in Minnesota. By like like it's not even close. I want over here carrying all the meat off first. Stephen W. Cleaning it. See, but this is what I'm talking about. Look at, like, already how much sauce is on your fucking hands. Yeah, I know. Like, and like, that was a gone. strategic error. Because, yeah. um, I, like I said, I went into it like a barbarian, but I didn't, but that, it wasn't necessary to do that. Yeah, I don't yeah, know. Yeah. It, maybe. Look at that. Take notes, y'all. That's how you like a bone. All right. It's looking pretty even so far, everybody. Freddie V even looks like Sarah got one down already. A new slow and steady wins the race, my friend. You got it. You got it. So the spice hadn't really caught up a whole you lot here. I could tell it was it was obviously like hot He's to like the immediately going in, but not burning, burning. So right now, what I'm doing yeah. is first. Um, this is my third one here that I'm eating, and uh, what I'm focusing on now is uh, getting in a rhythm of swallowing the chicken that's in my mouth while also chewing at the same time because i was uh i was building up a lot of chicken in my mouth which you don't want to do you want to have a continuous motion of, yeah well you want it to just go straight down chew, too, swallow, the longer, chew swallow the longer it stays not in your stomach the worse it's going to be for you with spicy shit you don't see my tears you don't see my you don't see my tears you don't see nothing all right you can't see me john cena over here oh a little john cena reference from the guy who can't commentate a fucking wing competition I wish I couldn't see him because then maybe this would already be over after his 17 full starts. He didn't see that. the speaker he wasn't I mean, supposed to get the microphone too close to and he squawked it. Juan, look at, oh, don't touch the face. Don't touch the face there. Oh. 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 Stephen A going here, licking the fingers now. There you go. Get that sauce in. Guys, in case you didn't know, these wings are so hot. If you know the Scoville level, the Scoville hottest as a unit of measurement determines spiciness, two million plus units on these wings. All right. For reference, if you're a fan of YouTube, the hot one. So yeah, he just the guys didn't right, catch that. He said that two million Scoville on, on these wings. Yeah, I knew that. I, I watched the hot ones, bro. This is uh, like look at all that sauce. Like you know, you were just yeah, you were just in, you were in you were in for such a bad time if you had finished that plate, man. I'm telling you, like having to eat that shit. Like that's that's probably the best part is you didn't have to lick your fucking fingers. It was it was a fucking mercy that you didn't do better than this. Yeah, I know. <laughs> Million Scoville units. Imagine they, they take one. This is seven wings. So that's number five right easy. there. All right, this. It's not a bad pace. At a minute and a half, you got five in. Yeah. Look, oh, look at, look at Stephen A's face. Oh, goodness. My plan was to have seven down under three. Uh, didn't Obviously, didn't make it. But, and I, didn't, I don't like to, before the things, I don't like to say those to the stream or say it on the video, even yeah, though I have gotta, a goal of mine. But yeah, yeah it's three. Goals. I was trying to hit three. Yeah, you got your own goals. Look at that. You got it. I don't Yeah, Jolly Green Dickhead says, those look like Jake's fingers. Oh, oh. <laughs> gross. Not now, Jake. We're looking at your bloody weird hemorrhoid <laughs> fingers. Oh. Not now, Jake. We're looking at your weird hemorrhoid fingers. <laughs> yeah, laugh about it, you fucking weirdo. I can't find it. Where'd it go? <laughs> Damn it. I hate when I can't find the sound drop. I was trying to find the guilty about it drop. <laughs> I, I never, feel guilty I about it. I never know where I fucking put that one. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I think it should be here. 
There it is. I feel guilty about there it. There we go. <laughs> yeah. Oh. Not now, Jake. We're talking about your bloody hemorrhoid fingers. I feel Ugh. guilty about it. No, you it. don't. You love it. <laughs> See, there we go. That's how it was supposed to go. I bet Jake Hudson owns birds. I'm just saying. All right, I know you want to wipe your eyes. Don't do it. Don't do it. Come on, Aaron. You, you can't afford to feed What the fuck is with this guy? He's like, Curtis, I know you want to wipe your eyes. Don't do it. He's wearing sunglasses. What the fuck are you talking about? <laughs> This guy's just like making up shit because he has no idea how to commentate. Listen to him. He's like, I know you want to wipe your eyes. Like, You know what I should have done too? And actually, I think it was Lemmy that pointed this out. I should have just bailed on the sunglasses. That's the same with my hat because it just got in the way and were annoying. Come on, Aaron. You got it. Aaron, you okay? You okay? Yep, yep. In there like some more. You got it. You can see it yeah, catching up with you. Yeah, certainly catching up now. The heat's catching up. Yep, it's catching up. You got it. I like the technique of ripping the meat off the wings first, getting that sauce on top of it. Look at how much sauce is on your face, though, dude. There's no way I that's know. not chemical. You're going to look like you had fucking food herpes, dude. That's, that's, that's why. Well, well, that's why the dude next to me was so go, impressive. Curtis. You'll see it. He had nothing oh, on his man. hands, nothing on his beard or oh, face. <laughs> Here come the zombie shakes. Here they come. That pain oh, no. is real. That pain is Curtis. real. Keep it going. You got this, nope, <laughs> you got this Curtis. It's just the like generic thumbs up. Like, if you fucking say so, because I don't got this. <laughs> well, here I'm still confident. Here I'm still like, I mean, it's it's catching look, up, but look, I'm not look, like, you can play it I'm strong. not defeated You can play yet. it strong all you want. You do not think you have this based on your body posture and reaction to that. No, no, that's bound to happen. I have no control over that. If you start like shaking uncontrollably, it's not about the shake. It's, it's, there are things in competition where people slight their hand uh, in MMA, right? Like whenever mm -hmm. a fighter looks at the clock, you know that they're trying to see when they're done. There's a moment where you look down and sigh, and that's when like, because I, I, I remember watching this on my phone at the venue last week. I remember watching it. Yeah. And it was when you look down and sighed, I'm like, oh, he doesn't got this. Cause, and it, it's right here, actually. It just happened. Oh, it is real. Keep it going. You got this, you got this. I'm doing good. <laughs> There we go. I will say that guy actually gave you a little bit of spike energy, though. You're like, all right, fuck yeah, I do got this. He did. Big well, you know, that's one thing that I kind of regret about it too is you. I they, I don't get a pan shot of it. I wish I had because there was there was probably at least like a hundred people there watching. Like the whole no, little that's, um, yeah, patio that's, area that's was full. That's where I think you. That's where I think you. That's where I think you fucked up in this because even when it was out like wider with the sun or whatever, like you should have had a shot where you could have seen everybody. Like maybe you just weren't able to get that far back, but like even when you were on, like you could only see like four people. Well, yeah, because you yeah. should have had like even because like like okay, so take this for the criticism it is, okay? Like w it seemed like you wanted to make sure that you were at the center of this because it was your thing, but in reality, because it's your thing, you're already at the center of it. It you did yourself a disservice by not having the panoramic view of everybody because then they could have seen how awesome and consistent that other dude was crushing. It would have been a better. It, it's it's weird because it's counterintuitive, but it would have been a better viewing experience for the audience if you had just shifted yourself back into the left to get the whole thing as a panel rather than make sure you were dead center. Well, yeah, that and that the, the angle is one of the things that I uh, that I regret about the evening, other than the obvious, the not yeah. taking home the cash. But that's one. But at the same time, too, dude, the I sun, was the sun um, was going to ruin it either the, way, though. The the angle became a little bit secondary uh, yeah. prior to the the competition starting. I was more kind of in the zone and let's. let's well, I'm just what I'm this, saying but, is just like when you when you have a panel. So when you have a panel of seven people, right? And you're setting it up to fucking do it. Like if you watch Nathan's contest, when they go, when they zoom in, they zoom in on the individual people, right? But when it's a panned out shot, they they're far enough back where they have the whole thing. Like if if you do one of these again, I would highly recommend that you make sure you can see everybody because I think like for me, it's really interesting because I would have loved to see the pace of that dude that one was putting on because one super interesting that he was playing it all cool beforehand, right? Two yep. super crazy that he was just sitting there in the zone minding his own business while everybody else was rubbing elbows with the pro guy, right? Yeah, and then and, no, then, he, and then because we because you focus because you're in the center of the shot, which you know your show, I get that, but because you're in the center of the shot, the two people around you didn't really do very well, and so it's like I get to watch you eat, which is cool. I get to watch you eat a lot because you're my friend, and then I got to watch these two fucking dill weeds do it, but I don't get to see the actual like professional eaters who I fucking hate, and I don't like like literally the, the like aside from you, the only people I'm interested in in this video I can't see. And it becomes well, worse. It becomes worse when you zoom in because of the sun, which again I understand, and I think I think that's the right move to do that because that sun was fucking oppressive. So, and that's why the 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 link for that short that I put together that short is on my channel, and yeah. the short has the different angles. Yeah, that's why I put it on there so I can reference each other when I put post both the videos up. Sure, but but you should have like edited that into the bigger video then. 
like just spliced it in or whatever. Hey, whatever, you can make another one or not. I mean, whatever. Who cares? Yeah, well, there'll, there'll be more. It's yeah. not my last one. Yeah. I think I think this is the last video you'll ever make. I really appreciate that for you. <laughs> Attaboy, Steven. I, Steven I'm, w, just here. Any- I'm just here for zombie. I'm right there. The, the gag reflex can, but you handle it like a man. Time right now. Four minutes. Right now you're hurting, buddy. You're fucking hurting. Oh, I'm hurting it. Yeah, yeah. yeah. But I... um. But like I said, I, I, there is a point. You're right. I don't think it's yet. There is a point when I look at the clock and I'm like, it's over. It's over. Your Huckleberry I'm done. says courtesy. But it's your not friend. yet. I'm no, still it, confident it was, at this point. It's his birthday. It was a courtesy because of his birthday, Huckleberry. Don't read too much into that. It's yeah, he likes to be on the outside of inside jokes. What a fucking Mark. Mark. Come on. You're left on the clock. <laughs> I love the. I love the head back chew. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> that was fun. Dude, like, yeah, it's getting it, rough This here. is so hot. <laughs> That's awesome. 50 seconds. Come on. It also looks like your teeth are bleeding. I know that's the hot yeah, sauce, but I it looks know. like your teeth are bleeding. <laughs> Shit's so spicy, my teeth are bleeding. Went straight to my gums. <laughs> Left on the clock. I think down. somebody said that it looked like a right. cannibal. <laughs> <laughs> like I think I, like, like, it looked like I just devoured Dude, this is, this is your, uh, human that, flesh or that. something. Look at all those Jake fingers. Oh, I know. It's so gross. Oh. I feel guilty about it. Oh, <laughs> I feel guilty, I feel about, guilty it. about it. <laughs> totally Jake fingers. This is my favorite where you do this and then you like shimmy and then you have to use your elbows to adjust your sunglasses. <laughs> I know. That's what I was saying. They ended up being just a total nuisance. I should have abandoned them before the, the, the contest. Oh, I was muted. Yeah, you probably should. I mean, it was whatever. You don't, you live in learn, like you said. I feel guilty about it. Attaboy, Steven. Steven W. Picking the Also, shout out to them playing Dancing Queen while this is going on, by the way. <laughs> Time right now, four minutes and 50 seconds. Come on. We're left on the clock. And counting down. Good timing right now. It's actually pretty good timing. Uh, Virtus 360 says I just ate your ass I just ate (laughs) Virtus 360 says I just ate your ass That is one of the (laughs) best freeze frames ever (laughs) I know (laughs) Wing teeth I've got reaper teeth (laughs) Yeah, It's from eating all that Jake ass bro Oh, I feel guilty about it. <laughs> and I feel guilty about it. I'm an iconic figure for these uh, young gay men. I'll suck a dick to be a super villain. I'm feeling oh. delicious. Oh, yeah. Here, here's the real drop for this. I'm feeling delicious. Were you, in fact, feeling delicious right now, Curtis? <laughs> oh, I'm no. Feeling delicious. I was I'm feeling, feeling delicious. I'm feeling delicious. I'm feeling delicious. <laughs> Boo hoo. Boo hoo. <laughs> Boo hoo. <laughs> Bendinucci. Gotta get a Bendinucci in there for you. <laughs> I mean, Curtis is on his uh, last two wings left. <laughs> okay, so let's see. So, yeah, right here, this guy, two, he's two in. And this guy can't yeah. tell. But this is what I'm talking about. So, like, when, when you were showing it, right? So, like, this is all I could see on the phone. I think that this one was maybe visible too. Uh-huh. Obviously, the sun glare and like a tiny phone watching it at the venue was tougher, right? Yeah. But like, so this is this is the widest angle that, that that's on the phone that that's right. zoomed. This is zoomed all the way back from my so, GoPro. So like going forward, like could you have put it back further? I suppose you want well, to be no, able to th- see. Well, no. Here's it, where it gets tricky, Corey. Is so the when I'm filming with a GoPro like that, um, I have a, a wife or a hotspot for my phone. So yeah. if it gets too far from my phone, oh then it, shit, yeah. yeah, then it's yeah. So that's where leave, it needs to be. It, just no, I, it no, needs I to got, be got, tight, got, like no, tethered. I, got, I don't know I how far, no, being, but I don't want to test it. You know, you're being a baby quitter. I got the solution. Just leave your GoPro, your keys, your social security card, and your phone way the fuck at the back. It's gonna be fine. It'll just, you know, you just put the phone back there with the fancy camera. It's fine. I'm sure nobody will fuck with it. It's fine. Just all the way back. Yep. Make sure you put in your keys, your social security number. It's fine. Way in the back where? Like all the way back. Like put it at the back of the pier, you know, just, just to get that shot, you know? I'm sure yeah. nobody nobody will fuck with random equipment just left out on the pier. I'm sure Absolutely it's not. And it's not like it's thousands of dollars yeah. combined or yeah, anything like that. It's a thousand dollars. Come on. It's fine. It's fine. 
Three and my, well, yeah, yeah, Lab's got it right. I mean, I, no, the cocaine. No, the I cocaine mean. you have to do. That, that's actually where I think you fucked up. You should have done the cocaine before the challenge. The, well, the, in fairness, the cocaine was was in me, not on me. Right, so. but if you could, but see, here's here's for the next one. You do a couple lines before this happens, right? Uh -huh. Like you're not going to be tasting the spice. You'll just be tasting that garbage nasal drip. <laughs> And then, yeah. oh. and then your your eating speed will go through the roof. You're you're not gonna, even going to feel it because your mouth will already be numb. Because like you're in Seattle, so all their cocaine is fentanyl. <laughs> I will say this though: there was a part. This is right around the part when I began to feel almost like I was suffocating. Uh, it was just so hot, and I felt like I was having a hard time breathing. Um, and it, it was it, it it yeah, that was harsh. Right here is getting pretty harsh. Yeah, I mean, for me, it's the zombie arms, which we'll get to in a second. The zombie <laughs> arms, I think, happen at like yeah. three. The zombie arms are when it was like, because the thing that I love about the zombie arms for me was your body was telling you no, but you still will down another two bites or so. <laughs> Tap it out, Aaron. Tap it out. First one is done. All right, so two and a half minutes. We already have one person tapping out. Oh, that's the other guy that bitched out. You fucking mark. And Aaron, you got humble speech. Still got a couple wings up. There you go. Look at the guy in the red next to me. The, the, yeah, he is questioning his life decisions. <laughs> oh, yeah. The Zen, and and guy, he says it later, guy, well, like, the think, Zen approach the guy, did not I think work. The guy, like, well, no, no, it I think, didn't work. I think the thing with the red guy and the blue guy are that both of them didn't have any illusions of winning, right? They just yeah. didn't want to be the first person to tap. And so I think once <laughs> yeah. once the first person tapped, people were like, okay, I'm not the loser here. You know, like, no yeah. matter what happens, there's seven people. I wasn't the first person that quit. Can we get the, can we get the, uh, the, uh, Aaron has tapped out. Can we get him a little kit there? Those that tap out do get a special save me kit of milk and uh, ice cream sandwich. That's so mean to tell people still eating what you're giving. Oh, I know. Like, oh, the guys that's that so, that quit next to you, they're going to hey, be rewarded hey, with so milk you, and yeah, ice cream. Just so you, you know, fuck. just so you know, these cowards are going to be in less pain than you guys. Keep going. <laughs> check. Stephen W. Wants a check. <laughs> I call this moment Curtis. There is no God. <laughs> you're like, why have you forsaken me? And God's like, shut up and eat your wings. Yeah. yeah. So right there, right there, Corey. So right at the three minute mark, the M and you'll see this in the short, but right there at the three minute mark, the MC is telling him, Oh no, you have to finish all this. Night. You gotta keep going. You still got meat on your wings, So he's telling him what he has to eat to because so he's already done with his wings. He's done with his wings and he's getting he, he, he did a wing test. Like he said, Hey, am I good? And he that's what the MC is doing. They had and you can't see it how, from this angle, of course, but awesome, they also had a, how, how the awesome judge is, there. Okay. I'm assuming it was the owner of the wing dome, so but he was the, the judge there. He was determined they're telling him right now, yeah, you have to finish to like all the Should all we pop it. over to the other one to see at that point, or should we wait till we're done with this? Uh yeah, it's up to you. It's your, it's your deal. I'm asking your opinion because you know both the clips. Let's throw let's throw the other one up there, yeah. Yeah, because I think like three minutes is what you're saying. Like, so all right, so here's the short. Yeah, I just would have liked to have these three in the angle. Like, you know what's fucked up is like beyond you, these would be the three people that I care about. And instead yeah. we get stuck with the fucking chumps. I wish I would if I could have somehow sat between that guy yeah. Juan and that guy Steven. But then again, I had no no idea who was gonna win. But you see that gloves on. You see that? Look Corey? at these fucking pussies with their fucking they wore gloves. gloves. They're right. the only ones that wore gloves. She has all that foresight to wear gloves, but can't wear a bra. Whammo! Who's the you to call? Wow. 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 Boom, boom. Boom, boom. That's see right there. That's so a three-minute mark so that's that we're just so watching. This is, so this is what we're watching. So so this yeah. guy is done. Meanwhile, yes. Curtis is dying. And this guy, yeah. this guy has four or five. So this guy's eating two wings. This guy looks like he's yeah. eating three. Who knows what the fucking Glovers have done? The Glovers. <laughs> Actually, here, we can go back a little bit to the fucking Glove Gang. Fucking Curly from a Mice and Men. Is there Vaseline in those gloves, you fucking pussies? Oh, hold on. Here Oral we go. Roberts and I entered a pie eating contest in Atlanta back in 2000. We reached our goal of 900, but unfortunately... Pie eating contest just gone forever. Oh, it's because you're eating math? That's not a good joke, Oral. Take your medication <laughs> and get some better jokes. 
So yeah, look at like so this guy like look at that. He's got like six. Like he hasn't even gotten through one wing. Oh, the wand guy. Okay, I yeah. actually yeah, that's the first time I'd seen this plate there. Like it doesn't look like he's. She looks like she's gotten th one down. Yeah, well, okay, this is what she did, Corey. This is what JJ her approach was. And you see that, that sometimes at, at competitive wing eating contests, her strategy was to strip all of the chicken from the bone, then also all the sauce from the chicken. So she did that, and she ate all the chicken, but as soon as she started eating the sauce, she quit. So she ate all the chicken and none of the sauce. And then afterward, you'll hear it. The, the MC's like, how are you feeling, Sarah? She goes, I feel great. All like cocky and bitchy. Like, yeah, bitch, you feel great because you didn't eat any of the sauce. I hate her. Yeah, dude. I, it's I just hate like, her so much that it makes me hate him and I had already hated him. Yeah. Like, seriously, both those guys, that's why I fucking hate Seattle. Like, that's what, like, when you, when I found out you lived in Washington, that's what, that's what you are to me. You're these guys. <laughs> well, no, the, the thing was, like, I was kind of quiet about it, too. I didn't want to go out and advertise my experience and stuff. I, cause the, those are the, actually, those are the exact type of people that I did not want to be. The guy, oh, yeah, I'm a professional. Dude. And I did, that's, they, they were, they were big douchebags to me. <laughs> not spicy, though. I just like to compete in things I know I can't win. Yeah. So the yeah, champion's no nature. Uh, if you guys yeah. want to do a hype train, eight one hundred bit donos gets us started. I'm not going to spend much time on it. We're going to keep wing wing. Dinging. It's a it's a birthday hype train. <laughs> it is. It's a birthday hype train. Seriously though, this guy's the competitive eater, and he's got like like what one wing? Like I mean, seriously. Like does has he even eaten a wing? Look at his plate. See and look, look at the guy on the on the far right too. He's already like he's chugging his milk. He got one or two. I don't give a shit about done. that quitter. Like this is the professional food eater. <laughs> It, it doesn't even look like he's eating a wing. Can you can you zoom in on that screen at all, Corey? How do you do that? I don't. That can. Uh, it doesn't work. I don't on know. YouTube. Oh. Happy birthday! Uh, it doesn't, it doesn't oh, work on the shorts. Work. It nope. just does that. It's like a plugin I don't have or something. But yeah, like like you can kind of see back here. Like he may have been doing that strip the chicken strategy also. Right, but there's no like. Okay, so look, check it out. One, two, three. Five, John, enhance, enhance. Five. <laughs> One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, seven. Like, she looks like she has two of them done or stripped, right? And then yeah. five on her plate. He looks like all of them are still on his plate three minutes in. Like, it looks like he's just been eating the same piece of chicken. Yeah. Look how much sauce on his gloves, too. Because he would have had, even though they're gloves, he would have had to lick the gloves clean. I'm just trying to see, like, exactly. Like, look at that, though. Like, seriously. I'll, she did go balls out, though. She kind of bitched out. I think that from what I could tell just in these other clips, because I there's a bunch of clips like these I've seen of different angles, and he, it looks like he was going hard it's at Curtis's, it. Uh, it's Curtis's birthday, JJ. I don't know, man. It looks like he literally has one chicken wing on. Yeah, that, that could be. Oh, maybe not. Those might be bones and sauce. He might be four. That would that seems about right. <laughs> look yeah, at the guy, right the at the guy point, that won so. that's looking like menstrual joker over here. He's like, I know. Want to know so how fun. I got these stains? Keep going. You still got meat on your wings, Merrick. Full clean bone club. Almost oh, you got it. You got it. You got it. All right, Aaron's looking good. No, looking great, man. So here's a yeah. Okay, we're Him gonna tap go back. Right we're next gonna go to back me. over here just because you know we don't want to get yeah. ahead of it. Full cool, clean bone club and the plate. You can still have some sauce. Gotta wipe that all off. Okay? Let's go, sir. Let's go. You're close. Lawn's <laughs> moving slow and steady. Oh yeah, pretty much downhill from here. <laughs> oh look at those teeth look at those teeth i got Seriously. that reaper saw reaper you got, that, you got that jake hudson butt finger mouth oh, oh. hemorrhoid oh. mouth i feel guilty about it <laughs> <laughs> this is this is uh jake after you fill your mouth full of his fluids oh no uh. <laughs> no <laughs> <laughs> I feel guilty about it. <laughs> Hello? <laughs> Sarah, killing it right now. She just eating sauce right now. Get that sauce, Sarah. Get that 
soft. Curtis still got a wing and some change and a little bit of soft left. Dig deep there, Stephen W. Dig right deep. Right now, I'm thinking, don't Clean puke. Don't puke. Well, you can already see you check swing twice on the puke already. Clean yeah. bone. This ain't Hooters, okay? This is a wing dome. You gotta get all of it, all right? All right, here we go. Nope, looking great, man. Looking great. You're killing it, man. Oh, oh, tap out! Stephen A. I like the real slow pan edit you did. That's hilarious. The guy's just mm. coming out with two and uh, Nick we'll call it three quarters wings left and some meat on the side. Are you pooping? That's your poop. <laughs> it certainly looks like it. I go from look like I'm pooping. It looks like I'm weeping zombie at one arms, point. Man. Looks... Zombie arms or get the fuck out. I cannot wait for zombie arms. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Man. Uh, 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 I can't please. He needs some ice cream sandwich and a, and a cold. That's so mean to tell these people what you're giving the cowards. <laughs> I know. Like, I you're know. sitting there And mind you, like, because, like, like, obviously my eyes are shut from a lot of this. Right, right, but they're, like, um, But I could hear like, everything that was yes, going on. of course you it can. Just... And you're, like, my entire body's burning. And they're, like, hey, these guys that said that's enough, <laughs> get these ice cream sandwiches and yeah. milk. And then you're, like, you're, like, sitting there in pain, like, oh, God, that sounds so good. Go it's like, it's like, it's like fucking on Braveheart. Like, just say it. One word. Mercy. Just say it. Yeah, just say it. <laughs> What's the mean? And you're like, freedom! Yeah. You need some milk. <laughs> I'm not tapping out. It reminded me of like the professional wrestling when like they, they hold their arm up. Are you tapping out? No, no, I'm not tapping out. Guess what time it is? <laughs> what time is it, Curtis? <laughs> what time is it? Zombie arms. <laughs> oh, there we go. Yeah, zombie arms. It's my favorite. You need some ice cream. The, the like, just like clearly not like consensual physical reaction your body's having to your dumbass yeah. just shoveling in poison like your body like and, and props to you and your stupid primate body it let you <laughs> shovel poisons into your body for four minutes before it tried to do anything about it oh i know like, i not, know I'm and that's what i was saying should... this on my stream the other night about it like that's why i was concerned about puking because it's like my body's basically telling me like curtis what the fuck else do we have to do to you to get the point across right. that we want you to right. stop what you're fucking doing right. hey <laughs> hey boss get fucked yeah knock it off would you sandwich and a, and a cold glass that's that's a great face right there too. The sun's really <laughs> fucking that shot up, but that's a great face. And like again, you know what this looks like? This looks like you're shitting while also squeezing two pieces of your own shit. Yeah. And and here's a point too when I guess I was a completely oblivious oh. to. I mean, like I said I was aware that I was filming, but I was like uh, at another at another plane, just didn't care at all. Could you see through time? That's what John wants to know. <laughs> no, yeah, like the Simpsons. Yeah, I saw, yeah. <laughs> I saw through time, through like, dimensions, and your body uh, had seven to do layers something. of hells. I saw your it all. Body had to do something to combat what it only thought was an open display of machismo. <laughs> what the? Curtis Bush so is now fucking, available in your country. So fucking mean to be like, hey, these guys are quit. Ice cream sandwich. <laughs> I know. And, milk. and they drop it off right next to right me. Right in too. front of you. Mean, you need. Here comes zombie arms. So now when I was watching at the venue last week, this is where I like was laughing because his arms go like this and he can't like, this is my favorite part of this whole video coming up. No. <laughs> Zombie arms. Curtis, yeah. you got it, man. You got it, One. You actually look like you're trying not to cry. Like, yeah. or yell. Like, you just want to be like, ah. Uh. You got it, Sarah. You got it. We rooting for you. Oh, no. Anoop, you're still in there, man. You didn't quit yet. Let's go. Oh, big lick. So he's looking to play clean right now. He's looking at you can you can go on the other yeah, if you want. Yeah, right look, now right. he's licking it up. Yeah, so he's tapping or whatever. Here it is, right there, right there. Oh. Look at that. That's when I saw that. That's when I messaged him I'm like. Dude, that's a you monster. That guy's a it. fucking legend, dude. Yeah, he fucking destroyed it, dude. He just went, he went completely balls out. And, and this is, uh, this is, I think, um, I don't know, about four and a half minutes or so. Well, let's see. We can tell exactly when it is. It's 417. 417, yeah. And I could hear all of this going on, too. And I was like, <laughs> oh, God. Oh. He doesn't even look like it. Like this guy, spicy, just doesn't bother him. You know what I mean? Like he doesn't even look that bothered at all. Yeah. Like, oh, yeah. Well, you know, know what? I I asked him on Instagram. I was like, dude. So I got to ask, how was your night afterward? He goes. He goes. Well, 
I made it home. <laughs> That's all he yeah, said. Yeah. So <laughs> it fucked him up for sure. Oh, for sure. There's no way it could. Here we go! Let's get a wing check. That's pretty good. You've got six, right? Like that's the last wing in your hand, right? That that little piece there uh, is the 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 final remains of the the six wing, yeah. Yeah. That's not a bad showing, man. Oh, oh, judges, judge. Clean! So now it's over. He just was officially named the winner. And I, and obviously it was a bit demoralizing like at that moment. Keep it going. Don't I think you could have battled through it. I really do. I think you could have finished it. I don't know, but look at, dude, look at all the all the sauce that my fingers, look at the, the plate, look at the like, sweat, look at the sweat and steam coming. I'm not saying your hands in the plate. I don't think you could have done that, but I think you could have taken down the remaining pieces of chicken. That's that's po it's possible, yeah. You can see you can see your head just steaming. Keep it going. Don't worry, guys. Second place is still here. Don't stop. Yeah, I know. I just, so this is the part when it looks like I'm weeping. All right, hey, you know what? I killed it. Oh, <laughs> and this is a point too. It was hard to breathe, like it because yeah. it's so spicy. Like you're, it's just like you're, you're. It feel like obviously I could breathe just never, fine, but it almost felt like having the wind knocked out of you. You know, when I you're never a kid, noticed, you get, I never it feels noticed, all, felt almost like that. I never noticed how weirdly small your teeth are. <laughs> are they small? <laughs> well, look at look at how tiny. Look at his tiny little teeth. <laughs> I have tiny teeth. Tiny Curtis, the tiny teeth. teeth. Yeah, little, <laughs> good old Curtis, tiny teeth. He's gonna tiptoe through the buffalo wing tulips. <laughs> tapping out here, Juan. Tapping out, all done. Over him. Juan just tapped out. Do you see that? Juan tapped out. Yeah. So it looks like the only people that didn't tap out were me, the winner, and this dude, Anoop, next to me. Let's go watch him. See if there's him tapping out. Well, the, the judge said Juan's tapping out. Hey, but like the moment that that dude is, I'm just saying, I wonder if it's in this shot here on this one. No, it's not. Yeah, this is just the aftermath here. A new being tap out yet? Curtis ain't tap out yet? What's well, you shook your head no. Your head's still in the game. Like, I respect that. Also, you're not wearing gloves like a fucking pussy. Yeah, I know. <laughs> or jean shorts. I mean, that's a good showing, dude. It really is. Yeah, I wasn't terribly... I mean, I, I don't know. Obviously, I had high hopes, and I spent the bulk of the first part of the video just kind of hugging myself up and saying how I was visualizing the win and all that. And so it was... I mean, I was, I was certainly disappointed. <laughs> you're, you're wasting too much time leaning. <laughs> less leany, more so eaty. This is the problem. <laughs> this is, yeah, less leany, more eaty. Uh, the, the thing about this, though, is that... Uh, like Less almost, zombie arms, more eat. <laughs> you should have just tapped because you could have been eating milk and cookies right now. No, that's one thing I wanted to make sure that I wasn't going to tap. I, okay, right, I may but not like, finish, but, but I'll make it to seven but, minutes. Then that's my own... But check it out. But, here, but here's the criticism, right? Sitting yeah. back and just making poses, that's the same as quitting. You might as well have the milk and cookies. <laughs> well, maybe. I wanted to make it to seven. I Sometimes right, you, but, you but readjust you, your but goals you, afterward, you, you know, you just in the middle sitting, of it. But if you were just sitting back, not eating, like you've already tapped out whether or not it's formalized, you're just depriving yourself milk at this point. Well, no, I mean, some, I don't know. I've done some challenges before, like on, on my YouTube and other Twitch things when that's, that is kind of the challenge is like you, whatever you go five minutes, you go 10 minutes without any, anything to eat or drink. And oh, I, I, I could make it saying. to seven. That's, that's the idea now. Saying. It's like, you're going to wait. Oh, I got it. So it's more just like, I'm going to endure this pain till seven. All right. That's it. That is a passive aggressive way to quit Corey. Yeah. Oh, no, shut up, John. Yeah, no, not, not wrong. <laughs> what do you, what do you expect from such a, uh, what's the word? What's the word? Oh yeah. We'll get you a napkin there. Hold on. Curtis, how you feeling? Okay, you, you pushing. <laughs> how you feeling? Just shakes his head no. Yeah, I know. It's like, no, but that's the thing. It's like, it's funny because I don't say, I don't talk at all for several minutes. And I, I, know, I don't know. It's goes, when you do talk, when you've got that <laughs> reaper in you, it sounds like goes, you're being, you, it sounds like somebody who's talking who's been tased. How are you doing, you know? Curtis? Like, <laughs> no. How are you, you doing, know? Curtis? No. No, no, I'm, no, <laughs> I'm not. No, I'm not. No. 
Look at those hands, dude. Like the fucking Sorry. all that sauce dude, on Dude, you're so lucky you didn't get chemical burned. I mean, look at all that fucking sauce. It's on your fucking forearm, too. I know. <laughs> and somehow it got all it got on my fucking neck, dude. What? <laughs> Oh, yeah, there's it's sauce. Probably, it's probably the flung off. It probably, I got sauce on my neck. It probably flung off when you were adjusting your sunglasses with your elbows. Oh, that could be. I feel great. Yeah. There she is. I feel I great. Feel Shut great. up. I'm feeling great. Yeah, do you feel great? Yeah. I feel great. You, oh my god, I feel you fucking great. Quit. I feel great. You know why you feel so great, you stupid bitch? Because you are in fact a bitch. How about that? The suburban liberal wine mom. <laughs> yeah, she is kind of a I'm wine impressed. mom. I'm impressed. <laughs> <laughs> look, at, look at just the tunnel vision of pain. Like yeah. your body is like, what? What are we doing, boss? Are we just, are we killing ourselves? I was on autopilot. Yeah, I one hundred percent autopilot here. When I, yeah. you know, the engine was running, but no one's behind the wheel type of deal. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah. Oh. <laughs> this is probably the second <laughs> worst <laughs> spice reaction I've had in my life, though. What was the first? It not the first was actually. Uh, uh, this food truck chicken wings in Sartell, Minnesota. It completely <laughs> fucking wrecked me for that, like that four or five not minutes. Spice. Or so. That was probably food poisoning because it's Sartell. <laughs> it could have been. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I, I had this really uh, bad reaction to some spicy food in Sartell. It was uh, It was not the best medium rare chicken I've ever had. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. I, I suppose it, I guess you're not supposed to cook it to 130 degrees. Yeah. Weird. Weird. It was still, it was still chewy and cold. It was a uh, chicken sushi. It's pretty good. <laughs> don't have to gas. Oh, Air in my knee. I don't know. <laughs> oh, glass is off. Oh, yeah. There we go. Fuck this guy. Glasses off. There you go. Shut up, fucking gay. Yeah. So right now I'm thinking, okay, one minute. This is my final. This is like custard's last stand here. This is like, you know, whatever. I, I've, this is, I have to go out and I try. Oh. A little, but I just want to no get avail. that like, game oh, face moment of the like sunglasses off. Wait, you know what we're gonna do? This one's getting slow mo, bro. <laughs> sunglasses off. <laughs> oh, glasses off. <laughs> Air my new Oh. <laughs> oh man. Sloth love wings. <laughs> oh, oh. oh yeah, there we go. You look like a baboon, by the way. <laughs> yeah, I know. A baboon like a, who ate a shitload like of Reaper wings. You look wings. like that small weird Indonesian monkey we were watching yesterday. <laughs> Come on, Curtis, you got this. Yes, that's what I'm fucking talking about. What do you mean? Just fucking, you got in the game and you're fucking like, you know what? Fuck it. Here we go again. That, that's the moment where you overcame defeat, my friend, right there. Yeah. <laughs> Because you wanted to tap out, but then you're like, fuck it. I got one more bite in me. Well, you that's what that was through. right around. Like I said, that was the last yeah, that stand was, there. Yeah, that, was, that what, was the I'm, fucking, that was the third one. God damn it. Look at, look at how much of Jake's blood and feces is on your hand. <laughs> oh, oh, come on. <laughs> I, I, I feel guilty, guilty about, about it. it. I'm an iconic figure for these uh, young gay men. I'll suck a dick to be a super villain. I'm feeling delicious. It is funny how good those three sound drops work together. Yeah. <laughs> that's my favorite though. I'm an iconic figure for these uh, young gay men. I'll suck a dick to be a super villain. I'm feeling delicious. Maybe as good as China, 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 vagina. I like looping together and finding patterns for our sound bites, you know? <laughs> yeah. Sarah, how are you feeling? I feel great. <laughs> I feel, I feel great. great. I feel great. Oh my god, I feel so good. I actually, it's pretty good because I can't afford douche, so this is really gonna fucking towel off my fuck hole. That's how spicy it was. I feel great. I'm impressed. I'm impressed. I hate her. I'm really impressed. Oh. <laughs> I quit the challenge and I didn't eat any of the sauce. I feel great. I feel great because I didn't do anything. Also, my husband's website is from Weebly from 2012. Yeah. I want him to one more bite my pussy. Fuck. Mag Magnus says, this is like watching an injured animal slowly dying. <laughs> I just want to put you out of your misery. <laughs> <laughs>
<laughs> well, yeah, I was, I was, I was about ready to put myself out of my misery. Unfortunately, there's no way to do that at this point. I just have to endure it. Yeah. I mean, I, I, that's and dude, like we were saying before, bef when I was all like in my little anxiety fucking trip, like that's what it was. I was, I knew this was coming. <laughs> you yeah, know, yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> like, and it's just, uh, you were so cranky earlier that day too. Cause I think like you were mentally fucked. Cause you're like, you knew what you were going to do to yourself. Yeah. And, oh. and it was a weird day and I didn't really sleep it all the night before. And yeah, uh, no, yeah, I mean, was... you're staying up worrying like this, this, uh, this contest seemed to have gotten in your head in a way that I've not seen anything get in your head. That oh, you've I marked the fuck out hard on this challenge man i really did <laughs> i want yeah and i don't know it's just a cool thing because and just the way that it all happened where yeah. i was the last minute entrant somebody canceled and they called me i got the call up just the whole thing was just cool yeah dude you were an alternate you did good for an alternate you did good for a kid that's not even supposed to be there yeah they took a shot on some kid and uh i did my best but right. it wasn't enough in the end and he got to meet some uh eating champions who didn't learn his name till later and also, they, they feel fine. They felt fine about it. They felt fine. Yeah. I feel great. Don't hesitate to ask. Oh, Air my knee on you. I don't know. Oh, glasses. Here we go. Glasses, glasses coming off. off. <laughs> Adrian, I'm eating do you wings. Have a, do you have a disability? <laughs> do you have a disability? Oh, oh, yeah. There we go. <laughs> Come on, Curtis. You got this. <laughs> you, know, you got this. <laughs> I love how you put it like you, you're, you're pumping yourself up after stopping, right? And then yeah. you put the one bite in your mouth, and your body's like, "Really, dude?" Yeah, I know. Like, it's uh, like, what the like fuck? Almost, Come on, we went almost, over this. Yeah, you almost we've threw discussed it out. this. You're, like, you're literally like, watch it. Like, you can see like your head and your your heart is in it, but your body's not. Your body's like, fucking seriously? Like, yeah, watch I know. your mouth like, immediately <laughs> as you put it in. Your body's like, nah. Oh, Air my knee on you. I don't know. Here it comes. Here, oh, glasses off. Oh yeah, there we go. Who the fuck? Oh, glasses off. There we go. Get fucked, dude. Come on, Curtis. You got this. <laughs> that. <laughs> it's, it's so good. You put it directly in. Your body's like, uh, how about no, dude? Yeah. There we go. How about no? I said, you need another milk? Please don't, don't hesitate to ask. Oh, air, air my knee on you. I don't know. <laughs> oh, glasses off. Oh, yeah. There we go. Come on, Curtis. Oh, you I, got I, this. <laughs> we call this maneuver the how about no. <laughs> yeah. Oh, oh yeah. You want to eat that? How about no? Yeah. And you got I didn't need and a bounce like, here. And then you're like, and then you're like, how about yes? <laughs> how about <laughs> yes? We're doing it. Oh. Now your cheeks burning. Uh, no, it's cheating. And then my neck and yeah. Was, look at the cheer. See, they cheered for me. Well, that's because you're the only one not quitting. I know. You got this, Curtis. <laughs> I just would have liked you to have seen you tackle that last piece of chicken. I know. It I know. Matter. I know. Good man. Good man, Steven. We'll, we'll, we'll interview you here in a second. Yeah, I know. I ate. I yeah, look at this. Ball guy on hot one. How see, bad did see you my legs you are just like Yeah, dude, you, flutter, you lean back, you flutter your legs, you look like you're practicing synchronized swimming. Yeah. <laughs> Curtis, you doing okay? So you will see a moment here. I think it's like right at 648. Um, I look at the clock and then I real then it says 648. That's that's the moment when I'm like, not happening. That yeah, that and then you yeah. can see it kind of looks like I'm tapping out or whatever. He asked me if I'm tapping out, but really I'm just saying like that's the end of it. I'm not gonna make it. That's yeah. <laughs> Hold on. Oh, took a piece out yeah it had to come back out you got yeah right here yeah sorry how you feeling curtis tapping out no not tapping out not tapping out okay uh, Noob, how you feeling so you had to do the professional wrestling I'm, no i'm not tapping out was that was that the equivalent of a two kick is that what just yeah <laughs> five oh. four Three. Yeah, they're talking a lot, whatever. One, so time. see now what I wanted to see is the moment they said time, you just get up. Somebody give me some goddamn milk. <laughs> yeah, no, well, I could barely talk, dude. Oh, so to our contestants. 
They should have had that milk ready for you guys the moment it yeah, hit seven. Fuck those I know. guys. Well, the thing is, they were very hospitable and like they were very kind, but they could have opened those little fucking milk containers because I had to open it myself and I got Reaper sauce all over the mouth and inside the milk. Dude, uh-huh. Reaper milk. Have you ever seen there's uh, there's this guy named Shammy who's like an Australian jackass thing. He's like a bunch of entourage people that live with him. One of the funniest like pranks I've ever seen in my life. Uh, I'll actually look it up real quick after this, but like like he puts hot sauce in the milk and then puts hot sauce in this dude's fucking thing. So he's like goes to uh, the, goes to the fridge to get the milk and the milk is half hot sauce. Oh, it's it's shit. one of the like funniest things I've ever seen in my life. Yeah. Steven W with the win with a clean time. Holy yeah, holy F. So now, see, it's, it's interesting how, how the sun changed. It went behind the, the pier there, and now it's a lot better. Yeah, your eyes, yes, not the blood, the eyes. <laughs> Ladies and gentlemen, thank you guys so much for sticking around for our Center Alarm Wing Challenge. Brought to you by the Wing Down. Give yourself some love, everybody. Yeah. Don't forget, come on by. If you, you want to try the, uh, the challenge yourself, it's available. You can do it anytime you want. All right, come on in the wing dome. Uh, speaking of, uh, they have multiple locations, including Greenwood and Kirkland. Greenwood, and Kirkland. I'm still, I'm zombified here too. I mean, I'm in a, I'm in another. I'm in another whole wing menu unlocked. Go and get it, ladies and gentlemen. No, I'm Justin in another Elba. existence. Thank you so much for your time. Peace. <laughs> Steven, how you feeling? Yeah. Oh, yeah. Reaper guys. milk, my favorite. Anyone want to tell about the crowd? That's my first time eating meat in three years. Wow. Oh, I forgot about that. He's a vegetarian. He came out for the, for the, for the wings. <laughs> so sorry. Good job. No, you did great. You didn't, you didn't, you didn't, you didn't pass out? Napkins, I appreciate it. You did it great. Please. Please. Like I said, it's always something just got taped. Oh, look at that, look pass at that. me some napkins, please. <laughs> look at look at this uh, this half vomit of fucking uh, hot death wings. Oh, by the way, Gurmy made out an excellent point. The guy who won, that guy Steven, he was a vegetarian. That's the first time he'd eaten meat in three years. Really? Yeah. Isn't that something? That is actually pretty great. Why? Uh, you you want to try the uh, the challenge yourself? It's available. You can do it anytime you want. All right, come on in the wing dome. Uh, speaking of, uh, they have multiple locations, including Greenwood and Kirkland. Greenwood and Kirkland locations have all you can eat wings every Wednesday, twenty three ninety nine. Whole wing menu unlocked. Go and get it. Ladies and gentlemen, my name is Justin Nova. Thank you so much for your time. Peace. <laughs> Steven, how you feeling? Fantastic. Yeah. Oh yeah, terrific guys. See, anyone want to? Uh, what do you want to tell about the crowd? That's my first time eating meat in three years. Wow! He came out for the for the, for the wings. Total possum. Good job. No, you did great. Oh, absolutely, Magnus. It was like I appreciate a whole bunch. It's like it's the moment of reflection and, and shame yeah, of like what the fuck. Okay, that coming a little bit this, later. At I this point, do, I'm just trying so to like the, survive. You know, this is the yeah. Aftermath. This is all the leftover. That's my plate. <laughs> okay, so hey, Corey, I do need to run though. I gotta go pick up my girl. We're gonna head out to the to the lake and uh, enjoy the enjoy yeah. the birthday. <laughs> but, uh, pop, uh, pop on in a second if you can. I'm just looking for this uh, clip. It's like two minutes if I find it here. I've got this. Okay. Uh, yeah, if you can hang out like five more minutes, I'll have it for, for sure. I want, you, I want you to see this because you'll laugh your ass off. <laughs> okay. So here we'll just finish wrapping this up. When I get when I get it, like as soon as I get it, we'll override this. I'm just having this play while. Good job. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Both. 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 Are you miserable? <laughs> Yeah, Magnus. I was I was just trying to like survive and get through, and like I knew that this this immer- immediate burn period would go away. It just it just sometimes it's, it's worse than others. Um, what I've done in the past is I've had like milk or ice cream or something, and I'll just soak it my tongue and my mouth like in in ice cream or like that I'm doing here, and it works to get it rid of it at the at the moment, but <laughs> it's not out of the woods entirely. Yeah. Do you think like is this something you'd do again, or do you think you're done with this? 
Oh, dude, I'm I. <laughs> no, I'm done with with this one in particular. I I still like spicy shit. I still have re I still will have Reaper sauce and stuff. But like going out of my way to intentionally fuck myself up like this bad. Um, I'm I I will be very. I'll consider the options or the different scenarios very closely before I commit to something this crazy again. Yeah. So you like, you think it's just like out of that? Okay. Yeah. Here it is. I found it. <laughs> Hold on, I gotta get like here. I gotta find what a way. What a, what a way to welcome yourself to Seattle. Punish it. Yeah. Yeah, I got you. Congrats. Good job. You did great. You did great. I was getting quick. You need more things? Yeah. Oh my god. Ooh, that ice cream bar did feel so damn good though. See what I'm doing there? I think I'm cleaning myself up, but what I'm doing is just wiping the sauce all over my face. And so, like half an hour after this, it, like it felt like my face, like I had a really bad sunburn, like my whole cheeks and my neck. It felt like it felt like a sunburn. Can I get a milk? Can I get a milk, please? This isn't it. Milk, yeah. Right here. That feels good. That hurt. That hurt. <laughs> you did it for the fans. I know. You did it for the fans. I know. I know. I let them down. Drop a subscribe. Drop a like. Look at you. I let them down. You didn't let them down. Look at this guy. He's getting you likes and subscribes. Yeah, here's another down. ice cream for you. I did feel that way though. I felt really discouraged, honestly. You know, my, my, my perspective on this changed since then, but at that moment I felt I felt really, really disappointed, honestly. Yeah, why? I mean I don't know. Well I wanted to win, dude. Yeah, I mean I really I mean I lost and I was I wanted to win. Like did you like I was legitimately just did you think you were going to? I feel like I thought yes I did. I legitimately like thought okay. I was going to okay. win, yes. I just really Yeah, and that's the mindset I went into it. Well, into that was that I'm going into into this contest to win it. Just didn't happen. We're having contractual negotiations. Stop it! All right, let's do this. Hold on, we gotta. I think I found the site. It's on. I gotta. I gotta find this. This is uh This is gonna drive me fucking bonkers. <laughs> what is that? Dude, what is that? <laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> oh, <fuck. laughs> There, I found it. I found it. I found it, baby. So this is one of my favorite pranks I've ever seen in my life. That was good. I like the chicken. Yeah, watch, watch this though. You want to see? You want to see masterpiece? This is a masterpiece. This is how I first came to find out about this dude. This is called the double switch up. This is where it becomes brilliant, right here. <laughs> it's so good. It's so good. Oh, 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 no. <laughs> dude, the milk is what makes this a great prank, dude. It's the double switch up. Like anybody can put hot sauce and food unattended. It's the fucking hot sauce in there that's the thing. And then yeah, they just have to play it cool. So here we go. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Ha <laughs> 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 
<laughs> he has no idea. And watch. And this guy can't take spicy at all. So watch. Gets a big old thing. Because you don't really realize it's spicy. You think it's just hot. You're like, wow, this is really spicy. Just another big old bite. <laughs> he doesn't even know. He doesn't even fucking know. He's staring at me. You know, it's spicy there, man. Oh my gosh, I didn't even expect that. Have some water. <laughs> <laughs> what is it? Is that the fucking hot sauce? <laughs> 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 oh fuck, my throat. <laughs> <laughs> oh fuck, I thought no, it was milk's be better. better. Milk's better than water. It's good for you. <laughs> oh, stop it. <laughs> <laughs> far not the milk as well so there you go that's uh one of the best pranks i've ever seen in my life <laughs>